Welcome everybody. It's Thursday. We're gonna be starting a new game today. The game that is Tales of Brasseria. Yeah. Yeah, so uh I have never played a single Tales game in my life. In my life. But I have heard many good things about this game, in particular that the cast is absolutely wonderful and adorable and super quirky and fun. And I have seen images of two of them? Yes. I think the main character and then the wizard character, which quite frankly was the character that convinced me that I needed to play this game because a spellbook skirt, like that's just the coolest thing ever. But yeah, hi everyone, I'm Jacob, uh, in case you didn't know, and I'm gonna be starting Tales of Berseria today. Welcome, welcome. Hey, what otters? IBG, one gamer. Pencil sharp, tropical pigeon. Uh, no, see, it it wasn't Caleb Astral projecting. No, 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 no. I I just I actually just really want to play this game. I know I chose Deer Autobata first of like the three that Caleb told me I need to play, but we are at this one now, and that's the important thing. Hi, Gooey. Um, yeah. Uh, I have basically no idea what to expect other than that it's a JRPG, so that means there will probably be found family, which I love, and then fighting God at some point at the end. Um, but yeah, I'm excited to get into this. Um, I feel like now that I've started playing a few JRPGs, I'm really getting a taste for them. So, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, can I get lost? Um, well, do not underestimate my powers, first off. Uh, second, depending on what, uh, if, if we get to choose a name, maybe, maybe we'll come up, maybe we'll do something that references the fact that I get lost easily. Although that might not work well since the MC is female, so Zoro might not fit. But, yes. Welcome, Lunar. Yeah, just however long you can, your modding is very much appreciated. Okay, so... Let's jump into this, shall we? Loud. Okay. This is a bit loud, so I'm just gonna turn. I'm gonna turn the audio down a little bit. Oh. oh. I was told that apparently, you get the ability to choose what settings for things like audio and stuff after you start a new game. I'm gonna be looking forward to that because it's it's really loud right now. Um, yeah. Uh, also, I'm not sure. I, I skipped the OP because I wasn't sure if it was like spoilery or whatever. Um, but uh, but yeah. Uh, can I watch the OP or not? I'm probably not on stream because you know copyright would be crazy for that. But um, yeah. Anywho. Ah, here we go. All right. Battle difficulty. Cool, cool. I'm gonna leave that as normal for now. Okay, 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 okay. Vibration. Vibration speed, okay. Mm -hmm. Sound output. Yes, I want stereo. Oh, surround. Oh. Oh, sure. Music volume. Let's turn. <laughs> let's turn. <laughs> let's just, let's just turn those down like that that seems a bit better maybe yeah a bit more manageable no I'm gonna turn it down even more or wait this doesn't seem to change anything here hmm okay all right, let's go. Yes, start game. Actually, hold on. Hmm, there's some really faction-based battle systems. More god than high bonus XP. Hmm. Oh, I can change the difficulty at any time. Oh, that's good. Hmm. 
Okay. Let's let's do moderate for now. Yeah. Okay. All right. Awesome. Cool. Love the style of everything so far. Colors are very nice. I'm going to want to turn off subtitles. Well, maybe not. Black-haired girls. MC, clearly. You hide here, Velvet. I'm going back to help Seneca. Okay. I'm so scared. Arthur, please. <laughs> You'll be just fine with these. Seneca enchanted them herself. They'll give you the courage you need to survive. That's sweet. That's sweet. Sure they will. Now, have I ever lied to you? Okay. All right. I'll come back for you once Selica is safe. It's scary, but don't give in to fear. Don't despair, no matter what. All right. I won't. I promise. After all, I'm Lafayette's older sister, and you're a student. Yeah, it's totally Christina V. I am very excited to have Christina V as the MC. That's gonna be a lot of fun. So um, you might not want to do that. Girl, maybe it's best to stay hidden. Okay. Um Is this some kind of monster within thing? Maybe being possessed. A werewolf. Okay. I like it. Okay. Going into the game engine now. Looks like. Is this after a time skip, maybe? Ooh, okay. All right, cool, cool. Was there supposed to be lines for that? Oh shit. Um Did I turn the Uh yeah, I think I might have I can't hear anything from like the voice. Maybe I turned it down too much, but Okay, hopefully it's not like a... Hmm. Is there... Err. Okay. Huh. Yeah. I... I didn't turn it down that low, and I, and I kept the voices and the videos higher, so... 
Huh. Yeah, I don't hear any of the talking either. Hmm. Would have been really helpful if, like, it showed me, like, what the audio was for the different settings when I changed them. Yeah, because, like, the, the background and everything is, I can hear just fine. And that was some of the stuff that I had the lowest. Oh, it's just... Well. Oh. I guess this is where I'm really happy that I have the subtitles. Okay. Right, yeah, the anime cutscene was fine. Oh, yeah, I put on surround sound, yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, so that's... Yep. Uh, I will I will do that. Thank you, Cypher HD. Okay. All right, cool. System. Options. Uh, where is it? Sound input. Stereo. Maybe I'll turn that up just a little bit, just in case. All right. So let's test it out. Rest up, all right? Don't forget to take some gels with you. You know, you're careless sometimes. I'll okay, cool. You just make sure. Don't worry about me. I'll be in bed resting. You better be. All right, cool. <laughs> What's this? Oh, wait, wait. Is there something I can loot here? Turn silver coin. Hell yeah. Historic ruins on reading historical impressionist scripts. It's like some kind of dictionary of a foreign language. Okay. How do I jump? Whoops. What's that? Okay, so X is the mini map. Hmm. Wait, wait, how did I do that? Oh well. Alright, mini map. You can use it to check locations if you're not tripping. Yep. Cool, cool. Okay. Mm hmm. Oh, that's the area map. Okay, cool. Right. Uh, display the current main story objective in the upper right. Additionally, the event list on the area map displays objectives in progress in both the main story and side quests. Cool. Okay. If I'm on the hunt for prickle bores, I'd better try the tranquil woods outside of town. This uh. is for Lockie's medicine, so I can't mess this up. Oh, yeah, I am... I am really going to have fun with Christina V as the MC. This is going to be great. Okay, so I think this thing up here, the top of the mini-map, is the main objective deal. Although, um, gotcha. Okay, okay. Is this is the Tranquil Woods. Come to think of it, Arthur hasn't requested his favorite dinner in a while. There's been so much going on, and the village always has him out hunting. Maybe he's just worn out? That does it. 
I'll cook him up some prickle boar stew, just like Celica taught me. That ought to pick him right up. All right, a cool. Portion of nourishing meat cures fevers and weariness alike. This is the formatting for the famous skits I've heard so much about, isn't it? Okay, so I'm just going to check. The... Okay, so system and then controller settings. So that's interact, cancel, long skits. Okay. Oh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. So I, I they're optional. I don't. So I'll need to make sure that I do them. And chat, if I'm ever about to miss a skit, let me know. All right, current objective, reset camera, okay. Show board, Denor, you know, bottle. Probably Estes for health equivalent. Um, change camera distance, okay. Page, pause, menu. Okay. Wait, I can't. So it's more of the angle than the distance. Hello. Hmm. Talking to himself, was he? Now that you mention it, Arthur used to have the same habit, didn't he? It's completely true. When I was heading back from the shop, I saw... Or wait. Is, is the child saying this? I was at talking to someone. It's all alone. Isn't that right, Othello? Meow. Was Laffy talking to Ceres? What was he doing at the store alone? Okay, okay. Ugh. It just isn't warming up, is it? The leaves change earlier every year. I wonder what could be causing it all. Hmm. Interesting, interesting. Okay, so that's this. But this is probably where I need to go. I'm guessing those red things are the... Oh, quest, maybe? Those... The red thing on the mini... On the mini-map might be the prickle boars. Ever since the opening seven years ago, this world's really gone crazy. Famine, freezing weather, and worst of all, this demon blight that's turning people into monsters. Oh, I can't cool. People can really turn into those things. It's a nightmare. Does so, no one know what causes yeah. demon blight? Or how to heal it? I, in particular, would like to know. What we do know is that when people turn into those monsters, I mean, demons. They gain incredible strength and attack humans on sight. <sighs> Whoever named it the opening named it right. It's like someone opened a portal directly to hell. All right, cool. Celica died during the opening, didn't she? Yes, it thank you for bringing up that painful she memory. She didn't have to suffer through all of this. It's good that my sister died? How can you say that? Uh, sorry. <clears throat> I didn't mean it that way. How did You're you mean it then? Sorry about him, Velvet. Hmm. I'll kill you first. Okay. Yep, that's just back there. Okay, cool, cool. Hello, child. Hey, Velvet. Is Lapiset feeling better? No, not yet. He needs a little more rest. I think. Aw, too bad. Tell him I'm looking forward to hunting beetles with him again when he's better. Right, got it. Lafayette's illness sure is persistent. Yeah, that fever still keeps coming back, like clockwork. The medicine always helps a little bit, but still, that sounds terrible. Let me know if there's anything I can do to help. Thanks, but we'll be fine. At least we've got Arthur to take care of anything that needs muscle. And before he came, Celica raised me and Lafay all by herself. So now I have to do my best, too. You okay. sound just like your sister. That optimism must run in the family. And I get I the feeling it won't last over the course of this nice story. Of to say. See a smiling face floating above someone, it means they still have additional, if optional, lines. That is good to know. So we'll soon see we'll be able to play once this fever's better. Okay. Should demons near the village, be sure to lock up tight. Okay. Okay, yeah, and then it's just if it's a flat face, then that means all the conversation stuff has been done. All I right. I should probably stock up on a few things before I go into the forest. Oh. I don't have a lot of money to spare, but like Arthur always says, 
Battles are won and lost with the preparations made before the first strike. That's true. But yes, I am doing shopping. Hmm. Uh huh. Uh huh. That's right. I'm try changing the little one's diaper. Won't be long before you're doing it for real, you know. Well, see. As far as first quests in this game, I don't know if that is, hmm, I suppose, I suppose it could be. Uh, 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 blush, blush, 16. All right. Oh, oh my, am I going to get, uh, am I going to get a reverse harem, possibly? Hmm? Yeah, well, I'm just gonna go and do literally anything else. Bye now. Thanks for the not awkward conversation. Nothing more to say. Okay. Can I? <gasps> Resistance ring. Awesome. Chests. Oh, okay, cool. Copper chests are consumables. Silver chests are standard equipment. Gold chests are exceptional equipment. Okay, and that was silver. Okay, cool, cool. What? What was that? Okay. Hey, Velvet, if you need hunting supplies, come to me. Not that there's anything else to, to go, mind. Ooh, okay. All right. Apple gel. Cannot be used while afflicted by a... By a what? Ooh, I only have 200 gold. Ah, if only I had more gold. Hmm. All right, I'm... I'll splurge and buy two of them. Oh, wait. Oh, that was to buy versus owned. Oh, so now I just have five of them. I just wasted all my money. Okay, wait, so what was that? Oh, blood blade. That's cool. City belt, battle garment, resistance, ring. A heart to defense plus five. Ooh, turn silver coin. Yeah, I'll sell that. Yes. Boom. I just made money. All right. Now let's see about, like, putting on equipment. Boom, boom. Awesome. Sweet. Attack plus five. Wait. Oh. I get 30 HP whenever I defeat an enemy? That's cool. All right. Okay. Um, now what, is, what is the art? Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Uh-oh. Uh. I can already tell that I'm, uh, I'm just not going to understand this. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I, I'm sure it's going to be fine. Oh, wait. 528 health total. Okay. All right. All right. Let's, let's go over here and see if... The, wait. According to the calendar, tomorrow should be Scarlet Night. The opening seven years ago was on Scarlet Night, too. I hope nothing terrible happens. Hmm. I see. I see. I knew that the opening in this game was fire, but I didn't know they meant like that. It'll be the same night as when Selica died. Hmm. They say the outlaws hold up in the Morgana woods all came down with demon blight. Oh, really? That, that, well, <laughs> we have to consider defending the village. Will this actually stop them? Yeah, but you were saying that a fence like this wouldn't stand up against an assault by demons. Exactly what I was thinking. But maintaining it is hard when there are so few of us. We need to build something stronger, like the power of friendship. All right.
Gotcha, good to know, Gooey. That's kind of what I figured, but it's still a lot. The leaves are really starting to fall, eh? Must be about time to start roasting us some potatoes. Potatoes. Oh, hello there, Velvet. Hi, busy as always, I see. Yeah, gotta feed the family and all. Oh, if you need some vegetables, feel free to take a few. You really mean it? I might just take you up on the offer. Aw, this is so sweet and wholesome. I'm sure none of these people will die or anything. That is not what's going to happen. Even more apple gel. I could have had a hundred extra gold right now. If I hadn't spent it. You ask me, wild prickle boar meat, meat beats rapig any day of the week. But still, there's fried cutlets, bacon, ribs, roast rapig. Like, like pigs, but, but rapig. And the ears, those are simply delectable. Okay. I, you always begin conversations this way? All right. Ahem. Oh, but that's good to know. There's a chest on the mini-map for that. And there's that one there. Okay. Hey there, Velvet. Have you heard the news? There are some folks going around pretending to be exorcists and tricking villagers out of their money. How did you find out about that? Did they see? No. They, they say they can see things that are invisible to ordinary eyes. You've heard that one before, right? Sure. Are you talking about Arthur? It's just a rumor I heard. These are trying times we live in. However you slice it, I'm just saying we can't be too careful. Mm. Right? Okay. Uh -huh. Ooh, this is a green exclamation mark. Does that mean this is a quest? The demon blight is a punishment sent to us by the Imperians for forgetting the old prayers. Mm. Who are the Imperians? The four Imperians created the world. The one Imperian shall bring it to peace. That Be sounds like afraid. bosses stuff. When contradiction permeates this world, the time of suppression will be upon us. Mm. Are you okay? Want me to take you home? <laughs> no! Don't treat me like a child! Ha. Right then. <laughs> oh. That so line was well. great. If you're going to the Cape, take care. Don't fall into the Shrine of Tranquility, right? I know. I'm not a kid. Of course, of course. You're 13 now, aren't you? 16. 16. Oh, wait. A shrine on the Cape has no name. It is a silent shrine of tranquility. Something nameless sleeps there. Demons and Empyreans slumber within. Wait, what? What? And this is a place of tranquility? Into the deepest depths, in perfect silence, sleep. Paid. Uh huh. Take care on your way home, all right? <laughs> exactly. Okay. <gasps> Chipped copper coin. A penny. Cool. Tranquil Woods. Okay, now, what I'm wondering is, is there a separate mode for, like, with combat? Because I can't... Oh, uh, don't see anything. Or fragment. Okay. Okay. Right. I don't see any... seem to see any way to just, like, this pull out my promising. sword or, like, or my claw or something like that and kill stuff. So... Type of grass that grows in the wild has a small value as medicine. Cool. Cool, cool. Okay, okay. There, prickle bore. Ah, so that's like, oh, hey, combat opportunity. <laughs> okay. Combo attacks can be performed based on the number of souls each character currently possesses. Wait, I thought I thought I wasn't playing Dark Souls. 
Hold on. Hold on. Does any combination of B, Y, A, and X perform a three-hit combo? By stunning, defeating, or inflicting status ailments upon enemies, you can get souls allowing for more combos. Alright. That's a cool blade. Combo. Twenty. All right. Cool. Hunted prickbowl meat, delicious and nutritious. Contacting the enemy while in the field will initiate a battle. Victory is achieved by. I'm gonna have to turn the volume back down. Attacking your opponents and reducing each of them to zero. Feel you are in an unwinnable battle, you can run toward the line at the edge of the battlefield to cause the escape gauge to raise. Once the gauge fills, you will flee the encounter. However, you cannot flee from battlefields that have a red border. Good to know. Yeah, that's how it's done. That's right. And now let's just let's just fix this real quick. Cancel. Uh, uh, there we go. All right. So now I've got prickable meat, and we could return. Whoa. Hmm. Uh, we could return home, but we will not. Not yet. Ooh, there's a chest. Andrew. Oh. Arts use up the soul gauge. When SG drops to zero, you can still attack, but you will be knocked back if you try to defend. Use left button to defend. Defending decreases damage from enemies, but also greatly re depletes SG. It also resets the camera's position unless you are against the wall. Okay. Enemy attacks with left button. Right, okay. here goes. Arthur's second maxim. Know your foes and strike where they're weak. Wait, I missed the skit. Oh shit! Damn it! Using arts when you have no SG comes with a number of detrimental effects. Combo speed is lower, is slower, and combos are more easily broken. Attacks are more easy to guard against, and attacks that are guarded will be deflected, leaving the attacker vulnerable. Status effects are less likely to be inflicted, and healing arts restore fewer HP. Stunned enemies, however, cannot guard, leaving you free to attack them regardless of your SG. Good to know. Oh yeah, the prickle bar's future. The cold weather's been terrible on everyone's crops, mm. but at least the city will buy our prickle bar meat now. That's Lauren right. And Arthur have been hoping the village could start raising them, but they can just be so temperamental. Mm. I wonder if they could be bred with more docile pigs. What would we call them? Oinkle boars? Yes, exactly. I mean, nah, doesn't sound appetizing. What about Pigglebor? Okay, yeah, yeah let's keep Pigglebor. it going. That's a cute name. Maybe too cute, though. We wouldn't want to discourage mm. people from eating them. But okay, that's good to know. They're like way down in the lower right-hand corner, so I need to keep my eye open for those. Another apple gel. All right. Cool. I think that might have been a waste of money. 
Ooh. More fragment, okay. What is this, though? Oh, save point, okay. Additionally, while you are exploring in the field, you can create a quick save by pressing that button to access the pause menu. All right, cool, yeah, let's... Persona 4 taught us, you know, save whenever I can. That's just something I can't get past. Maybe I'll figure out how to, like, break stone with my punches or something, and then I'll be able to smash that and get through there. But okay, I want to explore what that whole thing was, because that looked cool. Unless this just kills me. Oh, no, I can't go in there. Okay, I see. Now, I could go back home, because I have the meat, but... I mean, where's the fun in that? Besides, there was a save point here, so... There's probably something dangerous and difficult this way. Exactly. Exactly, Gooey. Consumables are an absolute lie. That's very pretty. Okay, cool. Not bad. So the SG regenerates at a pretty good rate. This should be enough to cover the medicine. I'd better bring these to the store. Okay. And now that I've left the zone, I'll go back and everybody will be dead. No. Um, let's just let's just make sure that there's, you know, nothing over here that I can I can grab. Explore the ocean. This place isn't safe. That hole's gotten bigger. Bigger? I told Wait. Them a thousand times they ought to build a fence, but they keep saying it's forbidden land. Uh. Even Celica used to scare me with it. She was always, this is a gateway to the underworld. Well, I'm too old to keep falling for that nonsense. So is this the, oh, I mean, rhetorical question, of course. This might be the opening that they were talking about. And if this is actually a portal to the underworld, then okay. I get the feeling we're going to be going down here pretty soon. Okay, I can't go down there yet. I need to go back to the village. Yeah, gotten bigger. It's like, um, wait, what? Can't go that way. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Is there a sprint button? Oh, that's a walk button. Oh. Right, here goes. Gotcha, so they respawn. Okay. This is still here. Yeah, no, it's opened. Okay. All right. Well, this is a fun game so far. I'm loving the atmosphere. I'm. Oh, oh they can't aggro. Oh, no. You want a piece of me? You want a piece of me? Fine. <laughs> Ooh, 
A bunch of pigs. Wait, the boars I hunted. Are you there? Oh no. I killed their families. Maxim three. Never waver once your sword is drawn. Okay. To control your feelings to control the tide of battle. All right. Hidden arts focus on the damage, on damage and attack range, but use more of your SG than martial arts. Searing edge is effective against beasts, gaining the advantage by exploiting your enemy's weak spots. Okay. Select so arts in the battle menu and set searing edge to A, then press A to use it. Oh, oh. Okay, cool. This is for Luffy. Whoa, were they healing each other? Yeah, exactly. Searing it, searing it, sear. Oh no. Ah. Cirrus. An exorcist art. Pride and anxiety, pity for the enemy, thrill of victory. Your emotions run too hot. That will be your downfall. Mm. <sighs> Agreed. It's one of her virtues as well. Who are you talking to? Yes, I know. But even so, she's got to... Hmm. Arthur? Oh, okay. All Arthur's right. fourth maxim. Never let your guard down, even when victorious. Got All right. In any case, this should be enough to buy Lafayette's medicine. Are you sure? See, this is actually some commentary about how the protagonist in these games just slaughters everyone around them. I don't think I'll be home tonight. I came out here to let you know. You'll have to pick up the medicine yourself. Okay. Right. All right. One more thing. I saw a group of demons near the village. Exactly, Jim Fangdo. If you're attacked, run away. Am I clear? I can handle a bunch of demons can only be challenged by those with the talent for exorcism that's the cold logic of the world and no emotions can change it all right do you think I could become an exorcist why is it you think that birds fly because they have wings Why? Well, without flying, they couldn't find food. Yes, a red one, but not a blue one. It takes a particular innate talent to be an exorcist. Unfortunately, very few humans have it within themselves. All right. Tomorrow is Celica's Memorial Day. I'll be back as soon as I can. Hurry back. I'll make you a quiche, just the way she taught me. Aw, that's cute. Everyone's gonna die. I leveled up! Wait, what? Hold on, hold on. I ate five things of pricklebore meat? Um, I, uh, I mean, 
I mean, anime protagonist appetite and everything, but, but even so, I basically, because I, I think I only got one per pickle boar, prickle boar that I ate, so, oh yeah, there's a skit. I wonder if those prickle boars were brothers. Maybe I should have let them go. Mm, but then maybe. how would I pay for Luffy's medicine? Hunting took care of that. And it means food for us as well. I'm going to need to get I used to looking no out for choice. these. It was a rational decision. But the fact that I'm still worrying about it shows that my feelings are getting the better of me. I just need to bottle them up more and more. I will slaughter any families that I must and then feed on their corpses for the good of my family. Hey, where is everybody? They're dead. Nico, here for groceries? Yeah. Not gonna say it. And <laughs> you must have been out hunting. Yeah, it was a good haul. Look at you, lady breadwinner. If you were a boy. I think I'd be in love. What's I'm stopping girl. you? Oh yeah? You want to do something about your style then? Um, hold on. Uh, I'm going yeah. for rugged I badass. Broke my comb. So <laughs> get a new one. Okay, that's that's a fun bit of like meta awareness. It's sure, like Sure, I'd like to. You, you see all these hey, anime Mr. girls with like massive amounts of hair, right? right? You two need something? It's like, oh, that seems like it would be I'm a pain to take care of. Yes, I no, I, I broke my comb. For Luffy said. Oh, Velvet. I already told Arthur, but I'm afraid the medicine hasn't come in yet. Do I need to remind you what happens what? to pigs that don't give me what I need? Is it because of the demons? Seems like the demon blight's really taking a toll on the city. There's even a group of them lurking around here now. Okay. When's it coming, then? I can't say. And I don't know how much it will cost. Oh, no. Ugh. What is Time to kill more families, then. Like, don't they have an army or something? Those guys? The demons already routed them a while back. But we're safe here, right? After all, your brother-in-law's an exorcist. Yeah, about, so that. Sure about that. Arthur can't even use his right hand anymore. He's Poor also leaving. Even protect his own wife and child. Oh. Let me know when the medicine gets in. Uh, oh, I like this. For now, here, on the house. I shouldn't have said that, should I? Huh? Velvet! You didn't forget, did you? You promised to teach me how to make your special key. You mean for that apprentice animal doctor you had your eye on? You were serious? Beyond serious! Please, this is life or death for me. This is really I cute. I thought your folks weren't keen on the two of you dating. Who cares what people think? That's right, you the tell them. Thing you show them. My feelings. <laughs> I like the way you talk. If I were a boy, I think I'd be in love. Darn right. But, but hold on, what's stopping us? Luffy must be starving by now. I'd better hurry home. Passive-aggressive societal pressures of our village, that's what. <laughs> oh, what? what's Russ going on? Down today. I know. You can sense they've the demons are coming. Like this for an hour now. Oh, well, shit. They've always been oh, no, I think that's actually what it is. Day, that kitty Rolo chased both of them up a tree by himself. I They're love it. hopeless. Whenever it's thundering out, they both dive into my bed, shivering. Orthy, Russ... Shape up. You're Nico's bodyguards, right? Mm. Start acting like it. That's right. They're completely hopeless. Maybe. But they're so cute. So I forgive them. Celica taught you how to make your special quiches, right, Velvet? Yeah, but mine aren't nearly as good as hers. Don't be modest. They're fantastic. Simple. Yet elegant. Ah, That's less is more. Secret in the cheese and the dough. You should try selling them in Taliesin. I'm wait, sure they'd be wait. <laughs> we could make them together <laughs> and take them on the road. We could even wear matching uniforms. Oh my God. Make more money than hunting prickle boars? Definitely, maybe. 
Even more so if you could lighten up a bit in front of the customers. Then it might be worth a try. I do want to buy Loffy a nice heavy winter coat. And Arthur's gloves are in tatters, so he needs new ones. Oh, don't be so boring. I get where you're coming from, but come on. Think big. Dream, Velvet. Dream. Imagine how much cocaine we could get. Mm, no, thanks. I want a peaceful life with Loffy and Arthur. Mm. That's all. You're impossible. Then again, maybe that's why your quiches taste so darn good. Mm. Well, the thing is, is that, like, because Caleb told me that, that Taos and Jaffe is one of the characters in this game, and he's, like, one of the, the funnier characters, right? So, like, I know that those two things wouldn't at all be related, but that's just so funny to me. Oh, wait, what? Wait. Hold on. Or I could make you happy, Nico. Let us go into our bright future together. Preferably before the tragic event strikes tonight or whenever and or tomorrow and we all die or specifically you die in my arms while I scream at the sky, blood pouring from my eyes. Hmm. Hmm. Okay. Uh-huh. 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 Yeah, sure. Wait, another thing to say. Oh, no, okay. Hmm. Hmm. I'm dad, huh? Yes, we abso absolutely should. Before everyone here dies. Okay. All right. I see how it is. I'm just going to see if I can sell more stuff to him. Okay. 25 is a sub price. Ooh. Mm, well, I suppose there could be... Well, okay, I can, I can sell the chipped copper coin. There we go. Five more gold? Geld? Get what it is. Okay. Now I guess I'll just go back home. You know, th I suppose that is gold. That's right. I suppose that could be a thing, Jim. Yeah. But it's just like, can, can we have it be spelled this way? Hi, Celica. I'm back. Oh, okay. I can't believe it's been seven years since we lost you. And the baby you carried. Oh, drat. I forgot to bring your princesses. I know how much you, Mom, and Dad all loved those flowers. And I know your child would have too. Oh, God. They're really, they're really nailing it home. Tomorrow. All right. Ooh, what you uh, working on? Velvet, Luffy, I told you to stay in bed. I was only up for a little. Look, your fever hasn't gone down a bit. Go lie down and I'll cook dinner. I'm sorry. Yeah, just What's being this? all mom. A compass. It uses a magnet to tell you which way you're facing. Woohoo. You can use the sun and stars for that. And what'll you do if it's cloudy, huh? Thanks to this invention, we'll even be able to voyage across the ocean. That's a good See? technological it's reference. To stay level, so your heading will be true even when the ship is rolling with the waves. Pretty neat, right? If you say so, Luffy. Come on, it's a must-have for any adventure. Can't you see how useful it is? Let's get you in bed. You can tell me more about it later. Did they hurt you? 
Not a scratch. And I brought back plenty. But I ate five whole I pigs while I was out there. Gosh, Velvet. I think it's time you learned all my secret arts. He isn't coming home to Oh man. Is he? How do you know that? Sarah stopped by and told me. Arthur's Moloch? Huh. You really can talk to Malachim, can't you? Okay. Yeah. Arthur says I've got exorcist potential. Ooh. No kidding. I think you'll be an exorcist to rival even him. I can tell you've been learning all sorts of things from his book collection. I really want to become an exorcist. I want to go traveling with you and see all the wonders of the world. I'll hunt and chop firewood, and if demons come for us, I'll defend you. I wish... I wish I could do that. Hmm. You'll get there, Lofi Set. It should only take... Mm. Oh, 20 years tops. <laughs> there we go. It won't take me that long. Oh, yeah? You better prove it to me, then. Start with this lovely meatball stew I cooked. Eat every last mouthful, even if you don't feel hungry. And take your medicine, no All matter right. how nasty it tastes. No tricks. Am I clear? Yes, ma'am. Okay. All right. Right. Cooking time. First, I need to light the stove. I gotta say... That part where she did the imitation or the impression of Arthur totally reminded me of Darkness's Kazuma impression of the Hey, Darkness, get your fat ass out there and get me my money. Believe it, but I can do whatever I set my mind to. <laughs> okay, okay, sure you can. I haven't really been watching many VTubers recently that are no. It's so easy to light Arthur's firewood. I wonder what his trick is. Hmm. Um, Velvet? Could you not put any spinach in the stew? <laughs> You'll never grow up if you're picky with your food, you know. Mm, I know, but, but just for today? <laughs> fine, fine. I'll leave out the spinach just this once. And I'll make it that curry flavor you want. All like. right, okay. Hey, Keep laying it on thick, why don't you? There's some of Arthur's special curry spice upstairs, isn't there? So. Hmm, wait, what? What? What was that over there? What was that over there? Wait. I. There was a. There was a silver coin there earlier, wasn't there? Spinach is fantastic, but not cooked. And it's less nutritious that way. The best way to have spinach is just raw and have like a bunch of it. And then, you know, yeah. Exactly, IBG. Yep. Okay. Oh, it's follow the mini map. Okay. There you go. Not spicy hot, but oh, so delicious. Okay, all right, oh, all right, yeah. sure. I saw Nico today, and she had very important things to talk about. She's coming over in the next couple days, so be on your best behavior. I will. I'm glad you've got a good friend. Yeah, we've known each other since forever. Really? But still, Nico falling in love. I can barely wrap my head around it. And it makes me a little Lofi, jealous. You know, if there's a girl you like, you'll tell Big Sister all about it, right? A g girl Hmm. You're a stubborn little brat, so you might need an older girl to keep you under control. Oh, and she's got to be a good cook. A pro in the kitchen is a success <laughs> at life. Knock it off, Velvet! You should be more worried about your own love life. Me? I've got enough on my mind. Ah, uh, definitely. Thing, I've got to cook for you and Arthur since Salika is gone. Besides, getting crushes on strange men? I just don't see what so... <laughs> oh, that was an adorable face. 
That was an adorable face. Wait, what? Nutmeg. Okay. Are you all right? I'll bring you some water. I'm fine. You just said something funny is all, and it made me choke a bit. <sighs> as long as you're okay. Sorry, I went off on a tangent there. <laughs> Who knows what the future holds? Yeah, but what more can I do? I've got a duty to look after my little brother, and I'm serious about it. They're Although really I'm laying it on thick. To Jesus. Look after you too. I want you to be happy. That's all. And it's not just me. Arthur worries about you too. Well, we're family, right? I see yeah. what you're doing, Dame. That's what families do. I see what Thanks, you're Bobby. doing. Funny, this is what families do. I'd kill every last prickle <laughs> in the forest if it came down to it. Yes. Slaughter of Pricklebore families. I need to hurry and get dinner ready. Oh my god. But like JRPG you, you know what would be great? If before we go into this whole thing that's probably going to have found family, let's just talk about the importance of family and show a family being happy and everything. I can't wait. A nice bowl of your curry stew without spinach. Yeah, 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 without spinach. Wait, what? Spatians on the Nameless Imperium. Isn't this Arthur's book? Is Luffy really reading stuff this dense? <laughs> Poor kid's gonna squint his eyes right out. Hmm. See, in Persona 4, it took you until like 20 hours into the game before you got the chance to cook. This game is already better, objectively and definitively. Good boy, you didn't forget your medicine. Well, All right. I did promise. Yep, uh-huh. Because we keep our promises, like not dying and coming back Tomorrow's home and Scarlet all of that stuff. Yeah, just like that night that changed our lives. Um, Velvet, may I sleep next to you tonight? Yes, do that. It'll either make it so that you're more likely to survive, or if you do die, the trauma will be that much more thorough. Potatoes in a burrito is a delicious move, is what it is. Okay, let's see. Today, I've got to dry some meat and use that cheese I've been saving to make a quiche for... Hmm? Luffy? Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, no. Is it just gonna be like, oh, Little, disappeared during the night? Open the door to go outside, and it's just smoke and fire and uh, ruin. I bet your fever hasn't even gone down. I am suspicious, chat. That's right, and the village is technically... Oh, what's this? Celery. That's, that's very good to know, very helpful. But... It's it's in a separate area. Yes, the pigs came back for revenge. That's right. Okay, all right. Living people seems good so far. Oh, but ah, the, uh, they're just they're just laying it on even more thick. Oh yeah, I'm so worried about my little brother. Oh no, if anything happened to him, I don't know what I'd do. I haven't seen him. Wait, that's one of Arthur's. Actually, it's a copy that Luffy set made. 
He just copied the whole damn book? A smart merchant would pay a pretty penny for this book. I gave him a fair trade. Luffy, did he really copy all that by hand? Damn. Oh, he must have done it to buy that compass. No, nice. though he gave it some puppy eyes. Oh. I told him I'd throw it in for free, but he said that it would be a bad deal for me. He did it for the medicine, didn't he? He's a good lad, but not the merchant type. So, what did he use? No, no, for? yeah, I know that, Lunar, but that take a long ass time. My lips are sealed. You'll have to ask him. Oh. All right. I saw Luffy set walking around. Is he okay? He's not okay. Where'd you see him? He was headed for the forest. I'll help you look for him. Thanks. Do a sweep of the village, just in case. I'll check the forest. <sighs> don't, don't you do me like this so so soon, game. Wait, and more exclamation marks. I know. He might have gone to the Cape to pick flowers. I was going to have them join the search, but they won't move at all. It's like they're scared of something. Mm, mm. Oh, oh gosh, I wonder. Oh my God. Or wait, what if this is actually, what? Oh no, oh no. Mm. What if it's actually that Laffy set is fine because he left the village? And then when I go out to look for him, and then I come back to the village, everything is destroyed. I don't know, maybe I'm paranoid, but it's just. I'll head to the village, Velvet, you go check the woods. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh-huh, separate from everyone else. Oh, God. Ooh. Have you seen Luffy set? Nope. Can't say that I have. All right. Let me know the second you see him. Got it. Is he in bad shape? Well, he refuses to stay in bed. He needs his rest, but he's always mm. walking around or reading outside. I can't say I'm surprised. He's always been a curious lad. He likes reading difficult books. When I saw him the other day, he told me all about the latest navigation techniques and exotic farming methods, too. Thanks for the save reminder. kid in a million is as smart as he is. You're exaggerating. Well, maybe not. It's a shame. If he could go to school in the capital, I'm sure he'd make a name for himself as a scholar. The capital? Hmm. Isn't that days and days by ship from Taliesin? No way. <laughs> not happening. Even if he gets better, I could never let him go that far away all by himself. Oh my god, can I can't. I, I just can't handle it. responsible boy. Mm. I don't think you need to worry. I couldn't handle it. I would worry. And be lonely. And that's why you'll be the lone survivor of this village. Then ask me about Scarlet Knight. Special red colored lunar eclipse. First Scarlet Knight since the opening. Hmm. Hmm. Well, gee. Gee, Rick. I wonder if that means anything bad's gonna happen. Everything's going to be fine. It's all going to be fine. I'm just going to believe someone who uh, says they can see things that aren't there. Selka might have a soft heart, but we won't be fooled so easily. Hmm. Yes, looking for Laffy. Yes, that's very important. Hey, Velvet, did you hear the news? Tonight is going to be another Scarlet Night. I remember the moon turned red seven years ago. But what is it anyway? Oh boy. It's a red lunar eclipse. It happens every several years or so. Apparently, you can predict the next one by watching the movements of the stars. According to legend, a crimson moon is a gate that connects our world to the next. It's also said to be proof of humanity's sins. Oh, lovely. You sure know a lot about it. Luffy said taught me just a few minutes ago. You saw Luffy? Where'd he go? Actually, I don't know. Sorry. Hmm. <laughs> Okay. Okay. Farewell, everyone. It was nice knowing you. 
I hope your deaths are quick and painless. I mean, they're probably gonna be fine. It's gonna be fine, but... But what if it's not? Oh. Hmm. There's a thing over there, so I suppose. Oh, 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 ho, ho! Ha, ha! My Persona 4 skills will not go to waste. Fluffy! Velvet, can you walk? How's your fever? I'm fine. I was just taking a break. Oh, you little... You know better than this, Lobby said. Running off without telling me. What if something happened to you? You wouldn't be the only one hurt. Do you understand that? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry. If you want to do something, just ask. I know I'm exactly James Seraph. Yeah. I can't afford to buy you all the things you want. Oh. No, that's not why I went out. You see, it was just. I get it. You're right. I forgot the flowers for the graves. Oh. Yeah. So I was going out to the cave. Oh, okay. And, uh, All right. Huh. Why, why do you have to do that? Too, don't you? Why do you have to do that? Well, yeah, that too. Fine. Just for today, though. Are you oh, sure? Boy. I am. But next time you run off like that, I'm strapping you to your bed. Yes, ma'am. In fact, let's let's Good. watch the ocean and the cave, like then. the eclipse Hooray! and everything. We have uh, your first first companion character, I think. He'll follow eventually. Uh, Laffy, you can handle a pig, right? Well, okay, fine. I'll... Right here goes. Huh. Say at no. Huh. Say at no. Is Laffy coming? Oh, oh. Is Laffy just... Oh, wait. Skit! Remember how we went out together to pick Princessias on the morning of Celica's funeral? Yeah. I was only four, but I remember. We couldn't find any in the village or at the Cape. Right. Because the demons had made a mess of them. And then you suddenly started climbing down the edge of the cliff. Oh, really? You went over and grabbed me. You had the scariest look on your face. Of course I did. Do you have any idea what I'd do if I lost you too? Oh, really? Do Arthur. tell. He'd help you. He'll help the world. He's quite the guy. That's probably true. But I'd still miss you like you wouldn't believe. I know. I'm sorry, sis. Uh... But down the cliff from where you were, a lone pair of princessia were blooming. I remember. A gentle breeze came in. And it smelled like Celica. That's right. That's why I believe those flowers were a message from her. Mm -hmm. Do you know what Princessia flowers signify? Uh, an irreplaceable treasure. And wishes for good health for many years to come. Okay. Right. And that sums up my feelings nicely, Laffy. All right, yeah. okay. Me too, sis. <sighs> yep, definitely one gamer. It's just... It's just all a bunch of red herrings. Wait, there's another skit. Wait. How about I make you some apple boo when we get home, Laffy? Apple, apple boo? What's that? Grated apples. Whenever I caught a cold when I was little, Celica would make it for me. It's sweet and tart and juicy and crisp. Eating it always made me feel better. Well, apples are good for you. But what does the boo mean? It's a good when question. I was a baby, I would always say boo boo when I wanted to eat an apple. <laughs> so that's where okay. the name comes from. Wait, you call apples boo boo? You must have been a strange baby. You used to do the same thing. When Selica and I heard you, we laughed so hard. Boo. Okay. Oops. You really wish for death, pig? I will grant it to you. Right. Is that all? 
Flawless strategy. Tactical genius, truly. All right. Just look at all these. This place never changes, does it? It does too change. The seasons, the wind, the weather. You change one and the sea's totally different. And the same goes for what lies across the sea. Across the sea? Hey. Sometimes I just If we kill everyone about. over there, will we finally be free? <laughs> hey, Velvet. Thank you for taking me out here today. You don't need to thank me. Hey, Luffy. Do you know why it is that birds fly? Well, if they didn't, they couldn't catch food. Or escape from predators. Thought so. But you know... I think there's more. Yeah, wings of freedom. Yeah. A bird that's born with wings has to. Oh, oh no. A demon. Well, shit. We can swim, right? No, the water would kill us from this high. Oh my god. Okay. You can do it. You're going to be strong, like Arthur. All right. Shit. Shit. Okay. Why is a demon here? I don't want to go alone. You have to. Don't let Oh, I just do I just do nothing to it. Holy shit. Oh my god. Shit. It's It's just like Oh no. That that would be a crazy twist wise man. But no, there's there's no way. I am glad that this thing is actually unbeatable. No! No! Uh-uh! Uh-uh! Hell no! Dude, run! Shh, fuck. Okay, I don't see any blood, but he could totally be dead. Oh no! No! Come on! Come on! Don't you do this game? Is this why? Come on! And then Arthur shows up. And then she awakens her latent power. I get home. Velvet! Fluffy! You're all right. Ugh. Sorry. It's all my fault. No. If you weren't there, there's no telling what might have happened to me. Your old one broke, right? You've got beautiful hair. It would be a waste if you didn't take care of it. This is below the belt game. I'll make a new world. This is below the belt. A world where my sister can be happy. Whoa, those are big words there. Scarlet Knight? What's going on? Was that... Was it all a dream? Wait, no. No, no you just went to wasn't. sleep. But why, why, why are you so worried? You're making me worried. 
God. Oh my God. He did kind of lunar, yeah, for real. Well, shit. Fluffy, where are you? What on earth is going on? This is no time to be scared. I have to find Luffy. God. Oh, God. Right, because some turned, and then the rest just killed everybody. Oh, shit. No. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. The village. Oh, God. Ah! Ah! Go this way. Nope, that's. Ah! Ah! Oh God! Hmm. Yeah. What? No! How could we have possibly seen this coming? Well, shit. These guys are a little bit uh, stronger than pigs, I think. Yep, yep, yep. It's just... Mm. Oh, right. I forgot about that. Yeah, there's that tiny little hairline crack in the mini-map. Okay, 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 okay. Alright, alright, alright. see. This is, I'm just trying to, because there were, there, you know, there there are two people that I really hope aren't dead right now. Luffy and Nico. Arthur. Arthur too, but you know, like. Velvet. You. Oh, thank goodness. You kept Luffy safe, Wait. didn't you, Arthur? Oh no. Oh God. More sentiment to cast off. Fuck! Oh shit! Run! Shit! Oh no! Oh no! Oh damn! Uh huh. Here, once was the seal to the underworld broken, and tonight, fear shall be born the power to save the world. With Lafayette's life as a sacrifice. Damn. What? what are you saying? <laughs> and he was literally one of the people where I'm like, eh, I don't, I don't really care if he dies. Lafayette seems almost like compliant in this. Like maybe not. Maybe he got like kidnapped and brought over here. But now this doesn't feel planned. This almost feels like a reactionary, responsive thing where, where, you know. Oh shit, this happened, I didn't realize it. And then all of a sudden, you know. Yep, yep, will do, Gooey. Thank you. Fuck. Oh! Oh, okay. All right. Let him go. This is an offering to the world. Huh. Why would you? Nothing can save him now. No, no, no! Damn, this voice acting. Not change. Ever a slave to emotion. Hence her being at the bottom of... Oh, damn. Oh, okay. He does have that JRPG villain kind of look.
Okay. Dragon, cool. Well, shit. Okay. The twin dragons. Oh, that was that was the speck of a person, yeah. Okay, and here's the arm. All right, okay, okay. <laughs> well, okay. Oh yeah, she, she really does look kind of like Kizu Hanakawa. <laughs> All right. A demon that feeds on demons. Arthur. Arthurian. Okay. Arthur! <laughs> These people were the villagers. Oh, damn. Okay. Holy shit. Christina V, the legend. Oh my god. Wow. Wow. Thank you, Khaled, for the five gifted Take tier one away. subs. Oh, and they transformed back. Oh shit. No. No. Oh, you're kidding. Demon blight has spread through the village. But do not fear. With my power as an exorcist, I, Artorius Colbrand, will end your pain. Wow. Wow. Oh, no. Don't you dare take that comb. Wait. Oh, I see. Well, this is the enemy. Why is it that birds fly? Behold my answer, Velvet. Arthur. I ask no forgiveness. The sin is mine to bear. Wow. Okay. Holy shit. I will. I will make you pay. Oh my god. Like she's in her own personal hell. Yeah, that is a hell of a beginning. Oh my god. Okay. All right. Okay. Yeah, yeah, not too much on Artorius, but but at the same time, I feel like I feel like that the whole thing of the lawful neutral paladin like is is totally summed up with what he said there. I ask no forgiveness, you know, for my sin it is mine to bear. Basically, so it's not the he's choosing to do this, totally a bad dude, but he's not delusional. Necessary.
But okay. Okay. Now there's some there was something I saw in here that I wanted to I, I wanted to check because that something about like the scene being censored in the Japanese version or something. I was I wanted to make sure I paid attention to what was going on. Um is it? Oh yeah. Artith, this scene is uh, censored from the Japanese ver Japanese version in that Arthur just straight up stabs Luffy. Oh. Oh, lovely. Okay. Yeah, that would be even more brutal. And that might be why the stab wound was very clearly like on the stomach in the in the cutscene. Okay. In lower battle difficulties, enemies attack less frequently and less and with less force. Okay. Offer benefits such as improved item drops from enemies. Also, some effects of potentite only affect activate on certain difficulty levels. You can change battle difficulty at any time by choosing options from the system menu. Good to know. Yeah, having a character kill a kid on screen, like, directly might have been a bit much. Wait, master skills. These uh, piece of equipment. Each piece of equipment has proficiency value that will increase based on the grade earned from battle. Upon reaching maximum proficiency, a character will permanently learn that equipment's master skill, enabling you to strengthen characters by equipping them with different items. Cool. Okay. If a character wears a piece of equipment containing an already mastered skill, the skill's effects will be doubled. That is very good to know. Okay. Huh. So did my world come to an end? Oh, shit. And for three long years. She just killed the monsters that were thrown down, thrown down here. Darkness and fed. Oh, my God. Wow. Demons. So I could live. So I could live long enough to kill him. All right. Be my brother's vengeance. Well, shit. So we're going to have to bust ourselves out of here somehow. Or maybe this is where maybe this is where the party comes in, you know? So so like like it's like a like you know, it's like they're pirates or something like that and they attack this place and in that like she gets busted out, you know? Oh, this bitch. Okay. You better give me back my comb, bitch. Your hair doesn't even need it. And your hair isn't that great anymore. Where is he? First, there will be a test. Okay. It will decide if you are worth teaching. Worth teaching? Why would you want to teach me? I'm wanting to kill you. Left button and swift movement to the target. Ha! Burning wing. <laughs> whoa, whoa. Tilt, but while well, defending with left button, you'll perform a quick step, quick step. It expends a small amount of SG to dash in the direction pressed on the and can even be performed during a combo. Perform a quick step just before an enemy attacks. The attack will only do one damage, and you will recover some SG. Additionally, a soul may also appear. Collect it to gain one soul. Okay. If you are not, I will kill you. Ready yourself. <laughs> So I guess I just can't use my demon abilities against her. Here I go. 
Why are you holding back? You noticed. Well done. You pass. Okay. Of course. His Moloch would never be so weak as that. I am his Moloch no longer. Oh. Ooh. First, did he piss her off somehow? Has transpired these past three years. There are exorcists now throughout the land, challenging the reign of demons with the help of. Tell me. Tell me where Artorius is. You may find him in the capital city of Logris in Midgand. Why are you helping me? Maybe that's the better you don't question. Stop to listen. I can tell you what it was you saw that night. Oh, yeah, the dragons. That night, the ritual he performed shifted the very course of the world. Okay. A host of Malachim descended, and with their strength, the emergent exorcists quelled the demon tide. Now, he serves as leader of the Exorcist's Abbey, an institution that enjoys the unconditional faith of the kingdom and public. Oh, lovely. A shield to guard the people and a sword against demons. Artorius Colbrand, the world's savior. With power stolen by sacrificing Lafayette. Okay. Indeed. But his power is not yet absolute. The man can still Oh, be he killed. hasn't become a god yet. Okay. Why are you doing this? Yeah. Make a successful escape from this place and I'll explain. Hmm. Ready for power, maybe? Escape. So that's your game. Fine. I don't care what the world thinks of me. What matters is my vengeance against Artorius. That's all. Okay. I have shattered your yoke. We must hurry. All right, cool. Still don't like her. Okay. Prodigy's Glacite. Glacite? Provides the ability for equipment to, ran to trigger a random skill that... I think that stick doesn't do anything. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. Okay. Seems pretty straightforward. Okay. Cool. All right. Martial arts swift kicks, hidden arts, vicious stabbing attacks. Okay. Using Velvet's quick martial arts to chain into hidden arts is a dependable tactic, but the elemental attributes on her hidden arts also make them well suited for opening combos. Gotcha. Island prison, Titania. Oh, that's that's the ladder that I used to get out. Okay. Cool. 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 Here, no, nope. oh, nope, that's just a urinal pot. Tarnished silver coin, hell yeah. So nice that they let me keep my stuff from before. Okay, uh, uh huh. More silver coins. Or fragment. What was that doing in a prison? All right. You will need equipment. There are weapons in the room ahead. Ah, it's push the stick in. Okay, good to know. Good to know.
Okay. So far, I haven't found any guards. Maybe she took them out for me. I don't feel like she's that kind of a person, though. Ah, okay. No one raised the alarm. I can see that. Take what you need from here. Okay. Oh, I can't grab the spears. Oh, oh, I see. It looks like they kept prisoners' effects in here. Okay. Well, this will be useful. I'll garrot some people. Quite a blade. Hey, nice. I know that sword, Stormhowl. What is it doing here? Well, it's too big for me. Is it though? Not taking it. It's a celebrated masterpiece. And if I can't use it, it's worthless. I mean, I. Why not still take it though? Ooh, dope. That is that is cool. Damn. All right. Are you ready then? Okay. What's going on here? Be careful. He's no ordinary soldier. He's an exorcist orderly. Turn like the sun. Damn, she's strong. Okay. You didn't even flinch. I already told you. I am his Moloch no longer. Huh. I'm very curious why she decided to turn. Is there a ship waiting? So you already know we're on an island. Oh, okay. She's yes. good. I've learned that this is a prison island for violent criminals. And that there are scores of demons locked away here. Demons say All lots right. of things when they don't want you to eat them. Oh, okay. The prison has <laughs> locks at both the front and rear entrances. Love the bandage Our ship aesthetic. Is on the back side. Got it. The back docks. Uh, I, that's a good question, Jim. Mostly it's because I heard that there was a character that had a spellbook skirt, and that just sounded awesome. Um, but, you know, I've also heard that this is a really good game, so I wanted to, I wanted to check it out. What is this thing? That's a special mass of mana. Think of them as the souls belonging to a family of Malachim. Okay. They appeared all over after the advent three years ago. Another after effect of the advent. If you collect right. enough of them, you might be able to solicit the cooperation of a Malak family. Ooh, that sounds nice. To take your word for it. I'm not forcing you to do anything. Whether you collect them or not is up to you. I might as well pick them up. I'll use every tool at my disposal. Okay. Indeed. You'll have to if you want your revenge. <laughs> now, hold on. So, okay, if that's a, a place that I can go up, then what's over here? Oh, it won't open. Okay, so I probably need to, like, get a key or something from this way. All right. Ooh, another one. God's another fight. Game. Two of them. This way. Did you hear? Prepare for trouble. Make it double. Now. They say the ground's weak and could collapse. Oh. Okay. The path that goes under the watchtower? That's all right. Nobody uses it anyway. Hmm. True, but it was a nice shortcut to the docks. 
Oh, okay. Cut to the docks under the watchtower. All right, cool, cool. A number of guards have gone missing. It would seem we have intruders on the island. Now, is that us or is that other All intruders? Break into two groups and converge at the front and rear gates. Okay. Understood. No one will get past us. That should clear the hallways a bit. Stay sharp. The threat could be serious. Ooh, serious. Yes, sir. This isn't going to be easy. Then we'll need reinforcements of our own. Where are the cells? They should right, be but they might be school. assuming that we're intruders. Is the thing. The Cause she's prisoners. betraying them, so I'll use any tool I have at my disposal. Riot! Riot! Ooh, maybe we bust out the prisoners and the prisoners are like the crew. And then it's like, hey, we get a party of like from like a prison break. Chipped copper coin. Thank you. Now, it's a red, but... Okay. It's through here. Who in the blazes are you? Uh, we're inspectors. See information on the current target. Okay. Gotcha. So, like, that one has the bigger shield. Okay. Ooh, pause the battle and see information on the current target. Okay, that's good to know. Mm-hmm. Here I come. Do, 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 do. Oh. Okay. We're finished here. Let's go. Been pressing B will bring up your enemy book information on the target. Okay. Check on your foe's various statistics, as well as what sort of equipment they can drop and the elements and potential status effects carried by their attacks. Good to know. Which door do we take? Oh, no. Wait, but you've been through here, right? You know where we're supposed to go, right? You can give information, yes? Oh, right, these are prisoners we're busting out. That tiger dude just rubbing the bars. Wait, two identical tiger dudes. Letting the demons out. Listen up. I'm opening every door to every cell. We're getting off this island. All right. What the hell? You serious? Yeah, I know. I'd be. It's like, um, hold on. Buy them dinner first. Split into two groups and rush the front and rear gates. Break through the gates and you'll have a ship. But aren't they guarded by exorcists? I mean, that pirate Von Eifried's the only one who's ever broken out of here. But he didn't pull it off just by himself. He was hauled out by some old exorcist named Melchior or something. I think I've heard the name Melchior. Melchior. I won't force you. You want to rot in here, then rot. Okay. With you. Anything's better than another day in this rat hole. All right, let's fight the gods. Come on, power of friendship. I'm sick of the slop they feed us. Serious. Oh, all of them. There, there's a lot of prisons. Okay. Yeah! Riot! Draw the attention of the guards. 
In the meantime, we'll search for that watchtower. Okay. From there, we can follow the outer path down to the docks. So you're leaving them all to their <laughs> fates. <I told laughs> yeah, exactly, you, one gamer. Use any tool I need. Oh damn! The friendly big sis is gone, and now she's she's ara ara destruction. They're just chatting. Oh, hmm. Should we stay or should we go? Oh. Damn. What's this over here? Oh my god, yes. You're not going to escape? Don't underestimate the exorcists. They're all gonna die like dogs. Or goblins. Filthy this goblins. In of this place. They're that amazing. Amazing doesn't even begin to cover it. The exorcists of the Abbey joined forces with the Kingdom of Midgan. And they've got the whole world in their pocket. All right. They're merciless. They hunt down any human who becomes a demon. Going against them means taking on the whole world. We will and take on the world government the if we have Those to. Those who get captured and sent here are the lucky ones. We may be monsters, but at least we have our lives. Damn. Sure. Until they get fed to me. Wait, Thanks what? For the info. Even if you manage to escape this place, thousands of exorcists controlling powerful Malachim will be out there waiting for you. There's nowhere for you to run. Nowhere. I'm not going to run. I'll gladly die as long as I take Artorius with me. Well, okay. Oh. A ride? Well, maybe you'd like to come with... Oh, what? Gotcha. I don't think that was shown on the mini-map, so I guess I do need to check every room. Oh, there's another thing there. Chipped copper coin. Lucky penny. Okay. Okay. <laughs> we can't let any item pass us by. We must get everything. Mm -hmm. Silver coin, yeah. Four more of those, and then I can get more apple paste or whatever. He's just scratching his butt. Attracted a merry band of fools, but we're not falling for it. Oh no, why would I help some perfect stranger? <laughs> I may have killed 30 men, but that doesn't mean I want to join them. That's right. If you have a death wish, and by all means, go right ahead. Well, I do, because I'm a badass, sexy anime protagonist. Why is this in a prison cell? What? What? I... Um, game. I... I feel... I feel like... There... That broke certain logic rules by... By, by doing that. I, I don't know, but, um... I already have battle boots. Hmm. Ah, yes, it's a mimic. And it just... But the impassioned speech I gave convinced it to not eat me. Okay, yeah. They're really getting into, like, the psychology of do you actually rebel against, you know, injustice, or do you just sort of, like, take your lot in life and hope it's, you know, better, better than death or whatever being undead oh oh he's just undead oh okay all right <laughs> better than being regular dead all right ah sure there we go yeah that cell was storage and they just locked it up in there as a way to make sure that other people wouldn't steal it yeah there we go there we go Okay. Dear me, not a word of apology? Who's this? <gasps> Wait! Oh, yes! With you yes! There I was, sleeping like a sweet babe, when suddenly... Hell yeah! No worse, a grimy prison cell. Yes! <laughs> you see why I'm not feeling well. Hmm. Wait, she and rhymed that. You are? Hooray! You asked! I'm thrilled to be 
thrilled to introduce to you the wise sorceress who travels the eleven seas, who scoffs at the might of dragons. None oh my God! Claimed, the illustrious Magikigikambi Lutindo Dindo Larundu, Magilu for short. Magilu. Wait. No, Ma, like soggy shoe or doggy do, or call me any of those things, and I'll turn you into a froggy stew. <laughs> Erica Lindbeck. I okay. Thought I recognized the voice. People can be so tragically unlearned. Oh my god. Like I care. Wow. That that was amazing. That was incredible. Wait, where where do these places go? To the other prison cells, probably? Oh shit. Yep, okay. Wait, so then the other places could go... Are these all different, like, prison cell areas? Oh, wait, skit! <gasps> no, did I miss the skit? Shit. Oh, a powerful witch, okay. I can't believe she snuck up on me. Who is she? This is no ordinary uh. prison. We must mm. be cautious. Trust no one. She said she's a powerful witch. Did she have a Moloch tethered? No, I didn't sense Malachim around her. She's an ordinary human, I think. Then she's an ordinary magician, not a witch. If she tries to trick me again, I'll crush her and be done with it. Mm -hmm. Now, was that the same skit, or was it a different one? Because I would really hate it if I missed out on it, but, you know. This character's parameters grow in various places around the world. Wait, 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 hold on. Oh, shit, I didn't actually look at what that gave. Was, I think it said something about, like, increase the max HP or something. Okay, same one. All right, good to know. Raises maximum HP by 10. Also restores HP on use. Damn. That's, that's pretty sweet. I think this is the same one, so. Yeah, okay, so this one's different. Okay. Or at least I haven't explored it. Um... Storage. It was just storage. Life model. Okay. Okay. Side. All right. Oh yeah. Sorry about that. Mm. Uh, uh huh. Well, <laughs> no. Yeah. Um. Ooh. Sorry. Once you charge them where the extra is down. Okay, I mean, that's eh. it's not a bad idea. I mean, mm, I, don't, I don't know, Chief. Maybe, but... Okay. Woohoo. I'm going to be rich by the end of this. Yeah, yeah, you do that. That's wonderful. Okay. Hey, thanks for the 100 bits, Rabbit Jawa. Cool to see a new game, Jacob, and I hope you enjoy this one a lot. I am enjoying it a ton so far. They they really they really played up the whole thing of like, "Oh, this is so sweet and wholesome and adorable. I hope nothing bad ever happens." When it's like, "Okay, clearly something bad's going to happen." But yeah, it were it worked well. I didn't like how well it was working on me, but it it worked quite nicely. Oh. Ooh, that's that's a that's a predicament, fella. Now question, I believe just to confirm 
it seemed like it showed Nico, um, Nico's dead body, uh, among the transformed demons after I fought them to get to Artorius. At the beginning, wait, no, I came from, no, no, I came from down there. Yeah, so this is, this is a new direction. Um, but was that actually, uh, uh, serious question. Was it Nico? You don't need to say anything else, but just was it Nico? Because it looked like it might have been Nico, but I'm not sure. Void ring. Okay, it was Nico. Alright. Reduced by 4%. Huh. Mm. Yeah, I can wear this to just, like, let it level up. Unfortunately, yes. Okay, that's... So what I figured, I hope not, because it was like, oh, man, that'd be great if Nico survived, and then it could be, like, the one person from the village. But no. This anime character does not get something as kind as that. I killed some of the guards. Ooh. Wait. Oh, please tell me. More? What's this? This one. He's a demon. Get ready. Devilishly sexy, maybe. See this? Well. You're not human. Neither are you. <laughs> True enough. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Ah! Ah! No, 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 no! Oh, God. Um. Oh, I can't. Wait, how do I. No! No! Okay, well. Alright, fine. I'll let me see. Yes! No, no! Nah. Well, well, no, no. Jeez, I, this does not seem to be working very well. He's strong. Ships in the blades already. Riddle these exorcist knives. Ah. I've got to reclaim Storm Howl. Oh, Storm Howl? That sword we found? You found it? Where? Do you have it? Please tell me. Yes, I just stuffed it down my it's dress. In the storage room, down below. Down below? You have my thanks. Okay, there we go. He's an odd demon. If things settle down, we'll miss our window. Hurry. Mm-hmm. Exactly. You know how this works, IBG. Yeah, boobs of holding. It's it's totally a thing. Oh, whoops. <laughs> Missed that one. Enables. All right. Ventite. Enables snipe charge in battle after guarding for a set amount of time. Obtaining certain items grants charge abilities to the guard command. With sharpshooters, ventite, snipe charge, maintaining a guard for one second to double the chance of inflicting stun to other status ailments within all immediately following attack. Okay. Oh, hey there, fella. That's a nice hammer you got there. Why are you trying to fight me? I literally busted you out. Here I come. Alleviate Mm. Alleviate wounds. Alleviate wounds. Thank you. 
We're do finished it. here. Let's hurry on. All right, there's a skit. Shit. Comes first. It's just way down there in the corner. Same combo. Right. It's based on the number of times. In the same combo. Okay. All right. Stormhell. Could that demon be? What is it? Uh. Nothing. That demon swordsman was just strange. He was so full of fury, but when you started talking about that sword, his manner changed completely. That's right. Don't think too much about it. He's a demon after all. The prison. Aren't you here also are kind of so though? Unusual. Oh, except for you. Forget it. Like I care what a Moloch thinks of me. Okay. Got the gate to the docks locked down. We can't break through. Okay, gotcha. The tower should be just ahead. Just want to point out, We've her hair looks this good after you three years with no away. comb. Prisoners are doomed. Hmm. Time is short. We need to get down to the path. All right, so no, no near camera angles for climbing the ladders. Oh, 320. Wait, did that say gold or gout? It probably said gout. Ooh, good to know, Jim. <laughs> uh, we can just swim, right? It'll be fine. The path has collapsed. That rope won't do any good here. Wait, you're not seriously going to try it, are you? He fell further than this back at the shrine. <gasps> okay. All right. I see you are truly committed to this. What's she going to do? <laughs> Teleport? Oh, shit. Oh, her shoulder was dislocated from that, and she just reset it. You're strong. I would almost think you made an oath. Oh, she might it's have. It's a ritual that grants special power if the oath taker abides by certain restrictions. Okay, cool. The cool. harsher the restrictions, the greater the power one may command. In a very real sense, an oath is a sort of interruption. Curse, right. Oh. Okay. Well, guess what? You're the ones who did this to me. Yeah. I am aware. <laughs> yeah. That is what Hunter I Hunter, chose is that you? you? That's why? You sure? Here I come. 
Oh, okay. Come on, really? Are you All sure? Right. This way leads to the main entrance. If they know you're here, oh, they'll have found your ship by now. The guards expect us at the rear, not the front. All right, let's wreck shit. See you, wise man. We're almost there. That's enough. Oscar. I had no idea an exorcist praetor had been assigned to this island. Okay. You surprise me, Ceres. Aiding criminals now, are you? It's a very punchable face. Did Lord Artorius request this? No. I'm acting on my own. I mean, you didn't have to tell him that. And yet, I sense someone's strings guiding you. Hey, don't you be looking at my strings. My eyes are up here. It's far more dangerous than an orderly. I'm all out of subterfuge. And besides, if we can't overpower this one, our end goal was hopeless to begin with. Wait, end goal? What's our end goal? You're a demon, but still a lady. So I'll show you due respect. I am Oscar Dragonia. Pray Dragonia? The okay. The Holy Midgand Empire. Who might you be? All right, graceless demon it is then. I like this music. Lord Artorius himself taught me the ways of purification. How will you fare against them? Oh, oh damn. Ah. No, 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 no. I don't want to lock onto him. Okay. No, no. Okay, that's right. I have to... Thank you for the heal. You're skilled. I will have to expend a Moloch or two for this. So, Rabbit Jawa, when you said that, I didn't think ReZero first. I thought Legend of the Galactic Heroes. So saying Blonde Reinhardt, I was like, wait. What? Oh. Of your vaunted reason. I like the animation for this. Oh god, is he transforming him or something? A Moloch with demon blight? Well, okay. It's lost control. Oh, just a dragon. Okay. All right. All right. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. I can take this. It's no problem. Oh. Okay. My wounds are fatal. Please. Consume me. Oh. I'm not about to. My form is bound by an oath whose price is my life. The time has come to pay. Feeding okay. my form will grant you strength. The strength to press forward. I ask only that you devour me. Well. Why? A flame burns in my heart, too. 
a flame I cannot quench no matter how hard I try. She really does, She's yeah. You, I kind of would have liked to have known why. Because that is why I cannot abide it. This she really seemed like an awful person before. Okay. Maybe she's being coerced somehow. Hurry. Before my life fades. Do it now. Yes, her hair is safe now. Yeah. I oh, offer yeah. no apology or thanks. Wow. Damn, she's hardcore. Our wishes. Are one and the same. <laughs> I treasured those days. <laughs> when you and I <laughs> and Arthur were <laughs> together. Wait, what? Gotcha. Okay. And then she saw the change over time and basically was like, I don't know if I can agree with this. Okay. Gotcha. Rain. Okay. That was kind of cool how the flame by the eyes kind of sort of vaguely looked for a second like um like her mask. What's happening is our no. anime protagonist is powering up. I'll eat you. Eating a dragon, that would be awesome. Sorcerer's ring obtained from devouring Ceres enables you now to use break souls. Okay. Form break soul. Oh. Okay. Once they have been unlocked for a character, these powerful arts can be unleashed by holding right trigger while controlling three or more souls. Such power comes with a cost. The, tar the character loses one soul and their target gains one soul. Oh. These attacks ignore combo limits and can be used to open combos, allowing for chains that exceed the number of souls currently held. Okay. She absorbed that mother's power to wield as her own? I've never seen such a demon. Keep cutting it around. Wait, do I lose the souls permanently? Like, I can only I can only go up to two now in this fight. Or... Oh, whoops! That was a waste. Did a lot of damage. All right, there we go. Apologies. 
Yeah, that was just but one I of can't them. Let a nasty demon like you roam freely now, can I? And this is when the friends show up, right? Velvet. Ah, that's, that's my name. name. All right. You can give Artorius my regards. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, absorbing the dragon. Hell yeah. Oh shit. Oh shit. Yeah, grab the person that's burning. Oh, okay, teleports him away. All right. Okay. Oh, finally some place that might not be a death trap. When we tumbled from the tower, I thought, this is it, Mogilu. This is the end. It oh would have been God. less risky if you hadn't suddenly appeared and jumped on my back. Oh, hey, it's you. It's thanks to you that Storm Howell is back in my care. Yes. I'm sure you're very happy to have your sword back. At your service. This blade is my life. I owe you a great debt, one I vow to repay. Yes, yes, she's a peach and a model citizen. Can we get our move on? I think they're just about done massacring the rioters. The docks are just ahead. Give me a hand. That was cold, but wonderful. Okay. Swallow dance. All right. And I leveled up. Oh, wait. Do I need to actually, like, choose what I'm going to spend my skill points on or my level up points on? Okay. Trigger, okay. Hmm. If your SG is already full, you're about to defeat an enemy, you can finish off your foe with a break soul essentially for free, as you will regain the soul that you spend. You will then be able to go on fighting at the same level. Ah, that's good to know. Additionally, when performing a break soul uh, comes with performing a break soul comes with significant HP restoration and can heal you even when inflicted with a status ailment. Be sure not to waste this opportunity because it could mean the difference between continuing the fight or getting KO'd. Good to know. Okay. Oh yeah, I've I've picked that up by now, True Warrior. Yeah, yeah, it's great. I love it. Uh, consuming Claw. Hold right trigger with three or more souls while standing up by or during a combo to pay one soul and activate. Hitting with this attack will cause Velvet to become ther Therianized, which drains HP but grants additional abilities based on the enemy type. Reaching 1 HP or performing an art when the maximum combo chain has been reached will unleash a break art and end Therianization. The lower Velvet's HP, the more powerful the attack becomes. Oh, that's good to know. I mean, you have to have all three, Jim, right? The weather's feeling as crummy as I am. Careful. <laughs> He's looking mighty choppy. Are you a sailor? No. Oh, I love it. between a sail and a rudder. I'll Which is? Do what you can. You're leaving without a proper crew? Very well, then. I certainly owe you this much, at least. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Brave words. <laughs> but ten minutes in this storm, and you'll lose all sense of direction. Zoro, no, is that you? We won't. Ships have compasses for a reason. Oh, uh, okay. All right. All right. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. So it's rot right in a jail cell or rot right in a fish tummy. Well, guess it's your lucky day, fishies. <laughs> oh my God. Yes, I'm I. For you, I had a feeling that I would love Muggy Lou. But yes, I absolutely adore Muggy Lou. She is fantastic. Okay, so we got away, and we got a ship. Cool.
They couldn't pilot the ship very well. Wait. Oh yeah, hold on. That did kind of look like Luffy set there. It also, yeah, I, I thought of Lalafell too, yeah. You really are a box of horrors, aren't you? Sorry. If I had a weapon, I would have helped. I promise. You're wearing one. Oh, nah, I can't use this. Sorry, long story. Okay. <laughs> the little brat? Scampered off somewhere. You ought to be scampering off yourselves. If you will come with me, repaid. you'll end up Until dead. Until it is, I will not leave your side. I can hardly scamper off without knowing from whence I'm scampering. We're lost, stranded, shipwreck survivors, no? Hmm. <sighs> well, then I expect this might come in handy. A map? Was that left by the child? Okay. Looks to me like we're in Northgand. Northgand? Then if we're to reach the capital in Midgand, we've no choice but to patch up our ship. What are your plans once you reach Logris? <laughs> Something worth breaking out of prison for. <laughs> oh, can't we stand around and chat somewhere nicer? Somewhere with soup to warm the body, tail to warm the heart? But we're in a tail game. city called Helleby's nearby. I can't promise they're much for conversation, but we'll find food in a ship right there. Okay. All right. All right. Earn XP experience and gold money through victory in battle. This is actually, since she devours the demons, that's a very cool and fun meta way to, like, have the leveling system be in there. I've seen a few games do that, but, like, it's, it's, always, it's always fun to see. Characters level up when they have earned the required amount of XP, blah, blah, blah. Leveling improves characters' basic parameters, increases their maximum HP, and unlocks new arts for use. The character who finishes off the last enemy in each battle will earn bonus experience based on the longest combo during the fight. That is good to know. Very good to know. Pressing Y while the area map is open. Oh. Okay. Be sure to check the world map when visiting a new location. All right. Okay. Oh, skip. Velvet, you know mm. that kid? I thought I heard you call him by name. No, I mm. don't know any Malakim. Not anymore. Anymore? Hmm. What? Well, whoever he was, there was something different about him, that's for sure. You can say that again. Using healing arts on a demon without being ordered to? Yeah. And he stole that compass, too. For being an exorcist Moloch, he's a greedy little imp. Well, we did help ourselves to a certain map of his, so... Uh, I consider myself an island of virtue in this sea of wickedness. <laughs> I suppose. Come on, it's not funny if you agree with me. You think? So this is how escaped prisoners behave. Hmm. No, these these two are special. Flamestone ship. Okay. Oh, another skit. Magilu, your way of speaking is as strange as your appearance. Hey, I'm a witch. I must project a proper age and dignity. Mm -hmm. I have an image to maintain. Self improvement in all things, I suppose. So, what's the difference between a spellcaster and a witch? There That's are a good many, question. but mainly it's a matter of nuance. It's like the difference between being frugal and being miserly. 
Ah, so a spellcaster is useful and a witch isn't, is that it? So I guess that makes you a witch right now. Wow. You wound me. Perfect. You want to talk, Mr. Self-Improvement? Your words cut deeper than these northern winds. <laughs> Why don't more games do that? Like, have those, like, skits and stuff. They're just so fun. And it's like... Oh, the wind, it bites! How can you stand wearing that garb? Uh. It doesn't seem humanly possible. I never said I was human. Mm, well, that's fair. And and yet, Mogilu, you're... Your skirt is spell books, which, you know, I love the style of, but I can't imagine it's very, like, going to lose, you can always try to run away. Yep. Uh, oh. Okay, try and run away. All right. Wait, what? What was that? No, no, I, I want to I want to leave. There we go. Okay. <clears throat> Anywho. Let's get stuff. Here I come. Come on, really? Let's see. Percent. Okay. Cool. 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 Each attack art comes with a chance to inflict additional effects. A good example is stun, which, when triggered, will steal a soul from an enemy and leave them dazed for several seconds. Stunned enemies also take double damage. Good to know. Wait, what? Was I at zero HP? Wait. See, I'm just, I'm just so good at everything that, you know, I, I was, I was fine. I just wanted to make sure that I, um, uh, oh, wait. Oh, Ooh, that's cool. That's, that's very cool. Hold on. Where was the sage that I got? Is this, is that a permanent increase for... Vibina also fully restores HP on use. Well, that's good to know. All right. Yeah. Here I come. Nope, no. Okay. Hmm. Cover. Come on, really? Ah, uh, I was on the new items tab. Okay, so. Okay, so I'll use that. I'll use that sometime later. But okay, that's, that's good to know. Here I come. Come on, really? Here I come. Take that, the power. You won't get away. Slow and turn up. Come on, really? Hmm, twenty-one percent on that one. Oh wait, whoop! Stabbing blade inlaid with amber, very easy to handle. Okay. Okay, good to know. Good to know. You know, I want to see. I want to see how I can how I can take these. Where, where'd you go? Where'd you go? Come on. Okay. Here I come. That was a pretty long combo. Come 
Come on, really? Okay. All right. Oh, whoops. Oh, another amber blade. All right. Okay. So nice to be free again. Able to move these bones around like I want. So, Rokuro, what got you all chained up in that mold hole? Ties to Good home. question. It's complicated. Okay. <laughs> Really sure you ought to be taking on further debts? It's a teaching of House Rangetsu. Pay what you owe. Mm. Well, what a civilized family you've got. Were you in for long? Three years, maybe. That's why I know so much about time. the state of the world. Huh. Oh gosh, me too. Art wielding Malakim. I've never seen such a thing. How much else have I missed? How long have you been in? Witches who had a monopoly on charms and hexes. Can you even comprehend what this will do to business? Should I even ask why you were imprisoned? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Begged for unlicensed witchcraft. Mm. It was a tale of betrayal most wicked and foul. So basically, you just didn't bother to get a license. Care to hear more? You'll cry. I'll laugh. Emotions will touch the rafters. No, thank you. <laughs> All right. Oh, what? These things. Ooh, is this little bunny something or cat oh no. something I'm gonna oh, have to so fight? Much trouble, so much trouble. What did I think? Oh, what did I say, bunny? Please help a kitty out, meow. Oh God, we have another teddy. All right, here we go. What if it's a cat demon? That is terrifying. She's just a cat. Haven't seen one in a good long while. Cats? Is that different from a regular cat somehow? It's a movie that no one should ever watch. It's complicated. Cats are a mysterious bunch. Just think of them as a special kind of Moloch. Sort of. So what's a Moloch? That works for me. I understand that they're hard to understand, at least. Hey, I don't suppose you happen to be carrying any cat spirits on you. They look like this. That's just like what I found at Titanic. Maybe? It's possible. Perfect. You could say they're kind of like our souls to us. Mm. Cat spirits, huh? Sometimes we call them kitten caboodles, too. That's just uh, of course. Really? Then how about kitty clumps? Anyway, one night we were having a Those feast chests. so marvelous, our souls flew right out of our bodies. That's why I need your help to find the cat spirits and use them to immiosipate my friends. Oh God! Really? It means to use cat spirits to free cats who are locked away in cats' boxes like these here. Meow. <laughs> the laziness of that meow at the end. Here you'd say apesipate. That's not a cat. This one would be edoxipate, and finally. Whew. I'm free, meow. See, emusipate. By that logic, shouldn't it be e catsipate? Wow, you're way more clever than you look. For real. I guess I totally underestimated you. Okay. Please, our cat spirits got scattered fur and wide, and so many sad cats are trapped without them. Seek out the cat spirits and rescue our poor cloth brothers and sisters, meow. And why should I? Please, think of the cats. You know, this is a party that wouldn't save the cats, powers. though. There's a good chance we might benefit by having them in our debt. We'll make it worth your while, I promise. Just and stop making those puns. Them, they might put a curse on us. That has been known to happen. Yeah. What if we killed them? <laughs> if we're doing all this traveling anyway, why not help them on the side? Just remember that it's on the side. Hmm. Hmm. Drifting through the world are like souls to the cats. People can collect them simply by touching them. You will need these spirits to open the cats' boxes found around the world. Cool. Treasure chest game opens with cat spirits you've gathered. Opening cats' box will free cats trapped inside, some of whom give you a gift of catitude. Why? Why? Find Kitty Clemson and Meow Spate, my friends. Something that will happen then, I'm sure. 
Just help us out. I don't want to have to curse you. Yeah. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. All right. Oh, yeah, there's a new item. Sure. I suppose. I mastered that. Okay, so that's equipment. So I'd want to go to items. Rocket charm, right? It will help you ride horses, right? Hmm. Well, there's the amber blade, but that... I don't think it's actually better than the blood blade that I have. Or is it? Um... Under fashion? Wait. Oh, okay. But in truth, she combs it until it's just right. Now that she has a comb, I guess. Hat style. Though. Sometimes you need to sweep your bangs out of the way so you can stay focused. Villager style. A long used comb broke, so her hair is a little more tussled than before. Okay. I think they're outfit. Village clothes. Okay. Prisoner clothes. Oh. Oh my. Ten gallon hat. Alright, so So how do I actually equip them? Wait, run one past equipment. What? Oh, here we go. Okay. Ten gallon hat. It howdy. Howdy, we are uh, we are going to uh, you know uh, rustle up some uh, some demons. Okay. Can't I can't change. Style helmet. Style. Uh. No. Eh. Eh. Maybe. Villager style. Oh. You know what her hair reminds me of? It reminds me of, um. Uh. What's her face? Chidori from Famofu. I think. No. That's. That's. That's better. Okay, that, that's a pretty cool look, though, but... All right. Uh, just general advice, be careful with fashion stuff if you don't want to ruin some cutscenes, potentially. Uh, ruin, like, like, what do you mean, ruin? Like, um, like, like, ruin for, like, narrative uh, immersion? Or, like, ruin like it'll actually cause, like, a bug or a crash or something? Okay. Box faces and tone dissonance. Oh, okay, that's cool. But if you wanted to go cowgirl, oh my, oh my, that's that's probably what you would want. What what chat would want there to be is the outfit, isn't it? Hmm. All right. Whale hail. Let's go. Uh, and blocked faces, do you mean, like, something in the way? Or, like, they just sort of are, like, blocky and don't move? No, I know. You guys would totally Exorcist. prefer prisoner's clothes, of course. Well, that's just inconsiderate. Word of the prison break couldn't have traveled so quickly. I somehow doubt they'll just let us in looking the way we do. <laughs> what are you talking about? What are you talking about? We look just fine. About earlier, I didn't mean to steal this. Ah, uh, yes, of course you did, wet otters. Yeah, yeah, uh huh. The compass. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, if their eyes are covered. Yes, yes, that is a great you okay point. Okay, with this, he could be working for the exorcists. I'm following him. Hmm, is he your dessert? If necessary. went by the coast huh. 
You must have gone this way. All right. No, 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 no. She does, doesn't get cold at all. See, the demon energy, it's, uh, yeah. It's, it just keeps her warm. It's fine. It's fine. You know, she was in rags for three years in a uh, probably very cold uh, dungeon cell. So, you know, it's fine. It's fine. They do, wet otters, yeah. I kind of like the dissonance, though, of the cowboy hat <laughs> with everything else. A storehouse? <laughs> that smell. Flamestone. Flamestone? Also known as Melchionite. A okay. rare mineral only found in Northgand. Mix it with sulfur and you get explosives. Mix it with oil and you get fuel. Okay. That sounds dangerous. If it's true. Believe me or not, it's your call. Looks like the boy got away. Well, we're in the city now. Well, then let's scout for the Maritime Guild. Whoever's in charge of all these storehouses must have their hands in the shipping trade and shipbuilding. And we could use a true sailor if we can find one. I was going to say, I'd be cheap. <laughs> yeah. We dodged the seas, I know it would be impossible, time, but, but it would have been hold. hilarious if the hat stayed. We should look for some weapons, too, if I'm to be any use in a fight. You're still wearing one. Nope, not an option. Mm. By the end of the story, he's going to use it, and it will be badass and awesome as hell. Okay, okay, okay. Lady Geld. Hmm. Takes about a week for a large craft to sail to Logris from mid in Midgand. Is that so? They say the savior Artoria is in there. Who did you say? I'd love to see him with my own eyes, but it's too far for me to travel. Oh, week by ship, eh? I suppose that means swimming is right out. Artorius, yes. Titans are my trigger! When I grow up, I'm gonna be an exorcist! No, you won't, child! Exorcists are warriors who protect the whole world from demons. You can't just protect your parents. You've got to protect everyone. Oh, mm. that sounds really hard. <laughs> it is. And it's precisely because the exorcists are working so hard that we look up to them. Yeah, exorcists are the best. <laughs> They're treated like heroes. I suppose to normal people, they are. Yeah. Richard Teresa can manipulate a pair of child Malachim simultaneously. Um. That this that sounds kind of dark. Hmm. Dread it all. At least the cargo's all aboard as planned. But the Abbey's really clamped. Oh, but the Abbey's really clamped down with their inspections ever since the disaster. It's a hassle, but inspections are in everyone's interest. The Abbey rules, rules keep things fair and equal. Yeah, that. Mm-hmm. Words. That's not going there yet. Hmm. There are beasts in the seas beyond here, pirates. The prey on trading vessels like a pack of hyenas. But swimming hyenas. They won't get away with it much longer. There's a special special cage with their name on it. Hmm. Okay.
Can I actually get on these? <gasps> oh, no, I can't. Damn it. Yahoo. Oh. A real beauty, ain't she? The latest design in Carex. I don't know how to pronounce it. I've never heard that word spoken aloud. Able to sail the open seas with plenty of room for cargo. She'll carry the resources to the north to every part of the Empire and bring the world's goods to Helovis. It's something like that. Alright, the hat is cool, but I think... Wait, how do I... There we go. Wait, okay, can't remove the hair. Alright. What is it? No, oh, no, no, definitely not, definitely not. Hmm. Yeah, no, regular outfit, best outfit. Hey, hey, she does have a big forehead, but... But she also has a lot of awesome hair. It's gotta be shown off. Haven't seen you around fur. You registered as a visitor, right? <laughs> yes, I totally did that. We don't put up with rule breakers here in hell of us. Hmm, yeah, mm, mm hmm, mm-hmm. Stuff. All right. Elavis has the largest number of exorcists in the north. Oh, okay. They're led by Teresa Linares, the Praetor of Praetors. Put a couple hundred demons in front of her and she wouldn't even flinch. Aye. Aye, compared to three years ago, it's almost like a dream how peaceful things are now. Oh, boy. And it's all thanks to the exorcists for warding the demons off. Mm-hmm. Sure is. I need something taken care of with the ship. Is there anyone... Is there anywhere that might help me? A uh, local shipping guild handles everything ship-related here. Just keep heading down this road. Thanks. I'll go ask there. Okay. Ooh, stuff. Ooh, a star. The sailors. Is that the guild? Oh, hey, that weapon shop looks promising. Good luck with the shipwright search. Boys, poor creatures just can't be separated from their favorite toys, can they? It's hmm. true. Oh. Is this a shipping guild? Damn that dial! What does he think he's doing by trying to resist? We wouldn't be in this mess if he were dead. Excuse me. We need a ship repaired. Sorry, but we can't help. Okay. What makes you say that? Guild business is currently suspended. Hmm. So we have to do a quest for the guild to by the order make of it so that they can leave? Of the Abbey. Oh. Lady Teresa. Number two. Did I give you permission to speak? Well, Lady Teresa, how ain't she a was bitch? This punishment of ours last. You know it was all Dial's fault, don't you, my lady? I know Dial was the one smuggling Flamestone, but your guild, through its negligence, shares responsibility. This rule was set down by the Abbey to maintain order. Do you disagree with it? No, my lady. We will capture, interrogate, and sentence Dial. When this oh, is shit. accomplished, you will be free to continue business. What is this interrogation going to entail for a simple smuggling? Mm, yeah, yeah, she really wants to fight him. And oh, you, right. Girl, aren't you cold dressed like that? Ah, uh, they're bringing it up! I've just arrived from the south. I wasn't aware Northgand was so cold. 
A young woman yes. ought to keep herself warm. Thank you for your concern. Maggie was just sitting there bored. <laughs> What's her plan? My my. So this is how the Abbey flexes its muscle, hmm? Cool, cool world these days. I see how things stand. If I catch this style person, you can repair my ship, right? Sure, but I warn you. He's a demon. He escaped after killing a bunch of soldiers who tried to catch him. Oh, okay. All right, that's Can't that's be fair. done without an exorcist. Hmm. He's from a small village outside the city. If you're doing this, I'd imagine that's a good place to start searching. Gotcha. He's a brute with the head of a lizard. I'd prepare for bloodshed. Wait, we in Doro Hidoro? Hey. Anything could happen. It's best to keep our options open. While you wait, find us a good navigator. <laughs> Ooh, okay, good to know. Show him no mercy. He's actually probably really nice. Oh, wait, that's the same thing. All right, what'd you say, Magalu? What'd you say? Resonance is a divine gift from the Empyrean, Empyrean who gives us the ability to tether Malachim. We orderly stand on the front lines as a bulwark to protect people from demons. Praetors are our superiors, but also have civil and economic duties and lead religious services. Is this how you talk to every, like, random civilian that comes up and talks to you? It is not a position for the faint-hearted. Or, oh, are they trying to, like... Okay, maybe that's what they're talking about. You don't have to worry about getting attacked by demons while you're here in Helavis. This town Helavis. is under the protection of the Abbey Praetor, Lady Teresa Linares. She keeps us all safe. Wow. She must really be something else. She is. She's lauded as the frozen queen of the exorcists. She's as cool as ice and as pure and dazzling as freshly fallen snow. She's just the white knight Helavis needs. Well, okay. As beautiful and pristine as it is, because we have Lady Teresa here with us. Yep, Anyone yep. who disturbs mm -hmm. her order, whether human or demon, will be frozen by her wrath, soul and all. Wow. Sounds just like an exorcist. Sounds sounds like a real fun person. Layers at the filthy. Oh, if only she would look at me like that, with those ice cold oh, eyes. God. Teresa, my love. If she lets idiots like him run around loose. And I'm sure she's not as infallible as he thinks she is. Wait, you just said that out loud. Okay, actually, what is this? Oh, okay, that's, that's pretty boring, all things considered. Huh? Fragment, what's up here, though? Nothing. Uh, what are you implying? What are you implying, one gamer? Cheats. Trying to find. Real good one. Okay. The blade was badly rusted, but once I polished it up, it turned out to have a fine edge. I can scarcely believe something of that quality was languishing in my bargain bin. You've taught me quite a lesson. The weapon is yours as payment. My thanks. Wow. So you'll help us out. Of course. How did your errand fare? I see. So we're hunting a reptilian demon called Dial, are we? We'll check out his hometown first. Have fun, you kids! You aren't coming along? I'm afraid I've got bigger fish to fry at the moment. That little matter of tracking down my betrayer. Hmm. Besides, if I stick around, I'm not so sure I wouldn't wind up as someone's midnight snack. My pellet has standards. Ah. High standards. All the more reason to skedaddle! Okay. Wait, bottom left. What's 
Bottomless, you talking bottomless to the mini map? The dressed gentleman sure has an eye for blades. Made from the same materials as exorcist equipment. That is good to know. First, let's sell. Uh, I feel like I don't need these. Because, like. Yeah. Eh. I'll keep one of them. Oh, VTuber joke. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The, right. D like, it's, it's like, s smart versus dumb, and then, like, pervy versus, like, wholesome, right? Okay, uh, so, don't let's turn the lights off, just put, thought there, oh, yeah, copper coins. Yes, yes. Okay. Or to buy. Uh, uh, uh. Look, a yak. Hey, Velvet, here's a fun fact. Yak tail hair is considered to be among the highest quality materials for a helmet's plume. Wow, really? <laughs> also, I don't care. Yeah, exactly. At my house, we had this helmet. It was an incredible piece, covered with yak tail hair. The talk of the town. House Rangetsu has two treasures going for it, people would say. The helm of yak and storm howl. They must not have thought very highly of the rest of you. <laughs> Why do you say that? Although, I guess I can think of a reason or two. Oh, well, it's nothing a demon like me has to worry about. Oh, best to avoid the front entrance? Okay. Alright, so we are going around the- oh, what? Alright. Okay. Oh. Did you hear? That navigator for the shipping guild, Dial. He turned into a demon. He supposedly killed and ate his crewmates. Then ran off. Demon blight? In hell of bees? What do we do? No need to worry. Lady Teresa is already dealing with it. Uh. She'll hunt down that dial character in no time. Yeah, yeah, yeah sure she will. Uh -huh. You can never turn back into a human. Is killing him our only option? Wow. Killing him would be a okay. Demons are just monsters who've lost their humanity. Yeah, you're right. Things like that aren't human anymore. Not human, huh? Uh, okay, okay. All right. Let's see what this game's setting up. Oh, resting it in has skit sometimes too. That is very good to know. Let me get this straight, Alpha Area. You want to form an alliance with my Gamma Area to Wait, bring what? the betas? Correct. It's the classic strategy: ally with a distant state and strike a neighboring one. Oh my what God! A council of war. The enemy of my enemy is my friend. Is that it? Indeed, if your alpha forces and my gamma forces work together, beta area is done for. I love it. <laughs> Kid like gang it. warfare. You've got yourself an alliance alpha area. Is this just for Excellent. like a bunch of snowball we fights or something? In this year's Hell of Ease grand snowball fight. Let us ah, good to know, victory. Super. This isn't a snowball fight. It's a snowball war. <laughs> Fools, I was the one who engineered their alliance. <laughs> Once they eliminate the area, the Alpha and Gamma forces will launch a full-scale assault to destroy the other. Exhausted, the victor won't be prepared when my Delta oh my army God. slams down upon them. They have sealed their own doom. These kids really fight dirty. All spare in snow and war. Nice, nice. All right, now let's forget our our crazy tactical planning and and go eat food. We're hungry. This cold is beyond ordinary. 
Well, Halavis is a northern country, but still, it wasn't this cold when I was a kid. Oh, the really? Tell me more. Ice were never this bad. I know it for a fact. Mm. It's that. What do they call it again? Uh, global cooling. Yeah, that's the one. <laughs> the Abbey says the world's getting colder. Thanks to all this cold, I need more warm clothing. Worse, I have to shovel snow and chop firewood all day. Ugh. Who's responsible Ugh. for this global cooling? Let me at him. Well, don't look at me. It's not my fault. Why is there an exclamation mark by this character? <laughs> I guess it's probably just because it's a voice line, you know? Because they want to have a bunch of different voice lines for, like, atmosphere and things. But... Oh, man. Wait, warp? Wait, this is where I came from. Hold on. Wait. Okay, so maybe now I go back over here, and then I can talk to them and be like... Wait, hold on. Yeah, complaining to Velvet. It's like, ah, yes, I have trouble with she? being cold. She transports flamestone and sulfur to the capital in Midgand. Have you heard of flamestone? It's this new yes, explosive I have. material the Abbey developed. Indeed. Thanks to their discovery. We can make some really powerful new cannons and explosives. Ah, uh, yes. Explosives. Good old war machine. Sounds dangerous. Abby's it wonderful. It is dangerous, but it's also necessary. Not only are there well, okay, demons, yeah, there's about, demons around. but we've humans to contend with, too. With pirates and bandits in ever-increasing numbers. On the bright side, with a higher demand for flamestone, Helloviz is prospering like never before. Flamestone is the only reason our little snowbound city is thriving. A keelhaul to anyone who says otherwise. So this ship goes to the capital. If I ah, asked, yes. You nope, not hmm. happening. The guild ordered a total suspension of activity. We can't lift anchor. Besides, any ship carrying precious ores has an exorcist on board for security. You need the Abbey's permission. Sounds like they keep a tight lid on things. Hmm. Yeah, I guess. But the Abbey makes the rules. So what are you going to do? Okay. Without the Abbey, humanity would be dead in the water. A keelhaul to anyone that says otherwise. All right. Well, I guess this wasn't the area I was supposed to be in. So, let's head back. Why does it say warp, though, when going through the gate? That's odd. And I can't go through... Or no, I can't go through the one down there. But What's this? Wait. Oh. No, oh, okay. Lord of the void and all creation, eternity and ether, Empyrean in nominat, please hear my humble prayer. Forgive us of our sins. Relieve us of our suffering. Bring tranquility to our souls. Okay. All right, well, that, that's that in here. Oh, okay. All right, the green dots are just people you can talk to. So. Um. Wait, hold on. Okay, so that's... Well, well. Okay, well, um, that's right, and all right, so, um, so am I supposed to just go back out the way I came in, like, just go back out into the, like, the flats of the city, or outside the city? Because I don't think that would be where... Oh, that's... Okay, chest. Back out the way you came in. Okay. So is there... On, on the mini-map, just so I can make sure that I like know how to read it well. Is there a... Um, a symbol that's like main quest this way? Like, is that what the what the little square thing is? Like the, the two squares within each other?
There we go. Okay. Star symbols main quest. All right. Hmm. Let's see. Why not? Why not? Square just means door to a different area. Okay. Ah, yeah, right, the star. Yep, yep. Okay, cool. That's right, because there was a bunch of stuff over here. Oh. Skit. Nothing but ice and snow as far as the eye can see. Are you cold? I'm fine, but I'm not the one with the exposed midriff. Doesn't bother me, either. And watch where you let your eyes wander. Hey there, sorry. I, I meant no offense. Hmm. So you still retain feelings like shame then? Wow. <laughs> you don't? Me? I've lost a lot of my human feelings. I figured that was just part of turning into a demon. I didn't know that. Hmm. But deep down, I'm still the same person I always was. And I can still enjoy a good drink. I'm glad I haven't lost that, at least. Hmm. If you say so. So maybe... Maybe Velvet's given up something else, but she just doesn't necessarily realize it yet. Sure, I'll fight you. Always ready to fight. Oh, hey. Your style is really unique. Mm. Just wait until I pull out the good stuff. Oh, stop flirting. I uh, can restored by means such as consuming apple gels and using healing arts. However, reviving KO'd characters requires life bottles or special arts like resurrection. At the end of a battle, any KO'd characters will be automatically revived with one HP. Good to know. Initially, battles will begin with three souls and you will be able to hold up to five souls at once. Each soul provides an additional 30 maximum SG, so having more souls lets you chain combos more reliably. Try not to let enemies take your souls through stuns and status ailments. You may find skills that will increase both the initial and maximum amount of souls. That is good to know. The main battle menu will change the active character. During battle, you can press left button plus arrows to change characters immediately. Oh, okay. Wait, does that mean... Okay, so I don't have... Gotcha, so Magilu isn't actually officially a part of the group yet. She has to, like, do her thing or whatever first. I see a village. Let's go ask around. Ha! Thank goodness I was here. But any further attacks and... Okay. An exorcist. Was that Dial she slew? No. It wasn't a lizard demon. Uh, are you crying? It's just... Everything that's going on. Oh, good to know, Jim. Demons yeah. Demons run rampant in the Outlands. And yet the Abbey has explicitly chosen not to come to their aid. It's true we haven't the forces to be everywhere at once. And the people of the Outlands refuse to obey the Abbey's rules. It's a heartless decision, I know. But it follows from the Abbey's perfect logic and principle. Hmm. Why make excuses to me? I'm not making... My name is Eleanor Hume. I am a praetor patrolling for the Abbey. What is your business here? We heard there was a murderous demon in this town who fled from Helaviz. The shipping guild incident, yes. I've been looking into it, but I haven't found any clues yet. 
<clears throat> Worry not. We will track down that foul demon and put it to the sword. Sure. Uh oh, it's Nanako. Did the exorcist lady go away? Yeah, she's gone. Oh, good. I didn't want us to get eaten. Eaten? Uh, I mean, I don't know anything about a demon. Hmm. It's fine. You can tell me. I'll keep it a secret. I promise. There's a lizard demon in a cave to the north. All right. He said he'd eat the whole village up if I told anyone. I'll give you these. Don't tell anybody, all right? Oh, That's damn. Is that going to trigger a memory? A cave to the north. Hmm. These apples will give you courage. Gotta say, the folks here really don't trust the exorcists, do they? <laughs> huh. This is actually rather good. Yeah. What's wrong? <sighs> Nothing. Can't taste a thing. Oh. Huh? Something that she gave up for being a demon. That's like some monster stuff right there. What we need to. Let's look for that cave. You want to kill people? That's fine. Just forget the taste of food. That woman said she was patrolling for the Abbey. What's that mean exactly? They're hand-picked agents who traveled the kingdom gauging the Abbey's success in the demon fight. They also make sure the other exorcists are conducting okay. themselves properly. I suppose you could liken them to military police. Since the Abbey imposes so many rules on the populace, they want to show they're above board. But if they need to gotcha. police themselves, Internal affairs, basically. isn't that as good as announcing corruption in the ranks? Well, some would say it's more honest this way. Idealism alone won't change the world. Maybe that's why our determined little exorcist was crying. I bet you're right. That does fit the picture. Hmm. Although it's best not to take a woman's tears at face value. Huh? Just some common wisdom. Okay. Alright, I like it. Okay, um... Let's just go straight to the cave and do that. Oh, wait. No, this... Cave look that way. I think it's this that they were talking about. Wait, my granddaughter said she spoke with you. Hey, hold up. It's not like we threatened her or anything. Don't worry. I know. I gather you intend to continue your travels, yes? Well, then yeah. This. It's nothing fancy, but hopefully it helps. Cooking has been added to the menu. Try it. Wait, what? Japan provides bonus effects in the next battle. Okay, the cooking menu offers three options. Auto cook lets you choose the dish to cook automatically after battle. Cook and eat lets you immediately cook and eat a single dish. Skills lets you check the cooking skills you've learned so far. Okay. Brickle or sausage. All right. On the left is the list of recipes you've learned, and on the right is information on each recipe. Okay. Cool. Try cooking up some prickle boar sausage. Select it from the recipe list now. What would have happened if I didn't loot that nutmeg earlier? I suppose I have two of them. Okay. Uh, choose the character who will cook the dish and the cooking skill you want them to use. Wait. Each character has different cooking skills. What? She uses stun to cook? Food's I'm so confused. Nothing special. The dish is complete. You will now benefit from its effects, and the character you choose you chose to cook the dish will receive cooking XP. Once a character earns enough cooking XP, their cooking level will go up, which will grant them additional cooking skills. Okay. Each character's cooking level is displayed on the upper right of the screen. Next, we'll explore the auto cook. Oh my god. This is a lot. This is a lot. Uh, only last one battle. That means you won't benefit from addition. Any subsequent battles? Cool. 
Auto cook allows you to have your party automatically cook a dish after every battle. However, please note that you will still need the required ingredients. The auto cook option works in the same way as cooking a dish normally. While exploring the field, the lower right of the screen will dis oh lower right again will display the remaining times you can auto cook your selected dish. If you are missing any needed ingredients, no one will be displayed, and no dish will be made after the next battle. You will either need to find the ingredients or choose another dish. This is a lot. This is a lot. Like, I I like that the game isn't isn't dumping all of the mechanics on me at once. You know, like it's giving me time to learn them and everything, and and explaining them and all that stuff. But holy shit, like, this is going into a lot of very specific things. Oh, no, I can imagine, Jim. I can imagine. It's cooking to your advantage in your adventures. Oh, oh boy. Now that hit the spot. Hey, Velvet, can I ask you a question? You can do whatever you want. You did not. But just because you ask doesn't mean you're getting an answer. So... About that whole apple thing. You can't taste anything? Not entirely. I can taste blood. <laughs> Nothing else? <laughs> Nothing. And I don't think I can feel full either. You don't think? You talk like you've never had a good meal before. Well, I have been in prison for three years. Not normal food, at least. Not since I became a demon. So, what have you That been solves eating? the issue of how did she Please. survive... You were in that prison with me. I'm sorry. Forget it. This is just what I am now. Okay. As long as I have a recipe, I can still cook. And now I don't even have to worry about how it tastes. I suppose. Food keeps my strength up. That's all I care about. Okay. Oh. Oh, okay. Gotcha. And then he gave a bunch of stuff for recipes and things. And another skit. Oh, yeah, the guy at that weapon shop gave me some booze for the trip. I hey, really sweet. Wait. You really think it's a good idea to drink? With yes, let's see these different. characters drunk. A little drink will warm me up. I thought you couldn't feel the cold. That's true, I suppose. Well, I'm not drinking it anyway. I'm using it for something. Like what? Got some wounds to clean? That's one use for it, sure. But I've got something more practical in mind. By pouring it on the pegs that hold the blade and hilt together, the wood will swell and hold everything firmly in place in battle. You've got such a one-track mind, I swear. That's just the kind of demon I am. Okay. So we exit. Ah, cave right here. So convenient. Thank you. Hadlow Hollow. Hmm. You know what? Sure. Yeah, I'll fight this. Don't get overconfident. Come on, okay. 32% bonus. <laughs> enemies will heal. We have a chance to enemies will inflict sad effects. Sad effects of one enemies. If you're a successful quick step or KO'd, you can collect these. The increase your soul count. Okay, cool. Cool, cool. Felt like that was pretty similar to stuff I'd heard before. Been told before, rather. Oh. Ooh, 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 ooh. Corpse dodge. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, 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 oh. Aha, wait. I think we might be able to break this boulder. And people ah, say I'm foolhardy. Because she's I'm got serious. demon powers. I think we can do it. Are we not demons? You have a point. Alright. Breaking boulders you can destroy. Cracked boulders by pressing A. Destroying boulders can open up new paths. And destroyed boulders will not reappear. 
So make it a point to destroy them when you encounter one. Cool. Ugh. What's that smell? Oil? Twenty-five, okay. Sure, why not? Square glasses. Ooh. Ooh, okay. All right. Or can I do both? No, just the one. Okay. Uh. Wait. Oh, no, so I can do multiple. Oh, awesome. I can stack them. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Okay. Oh my. All right. A fragment. Yep. Hey. Face tank, best tank. Okay, you know what? Let's let's fight. Tentacle. You be ready. I just yes I did I did I just went backwards okay we'll just pretend I didn't do that we will, we will pretend <laughs> so it was tar we were smelling watch your step you won't get out if you get stuck Actually, footholds you can use to cross the obstacle by pressing A. However, there may not always be footholds, or the distances may be too great to leap across. Okay. Well, hey, it's almost like the maps in this game are a lot more straightforward than in other games. No, 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 don't catch up, don't catch up. I don't even know where I'm going. Oh boy, just getting away from him. All right. The fact that they don't actually move faster than me does feel a little bit weird. Not gonna lie. Whoa, this is that's a that's a lot. Mm, no, I don't want to mess with that. Although I might have to. Shadow daggers. That sounds cool. Shadow daggers. Okay, gotcha. So he uses them. All right. Pair of short swords worn by those who live in the shadows in a distant land. All right. What does the lock unlock mean? Hmm. Yeah, exactly one gamer exactly well also not not just that but one of the other things that i that does that i do really appreciate about this is the fact that uh, um there isn't a lot of like you don't need to like find specific things for the most part to interact with 
in the environment. Ah, good to know, Supernova. But, like, any time that there's something where it's like, oh, yeah, you don't... Oh, too far to... Wait, what? No, come on. There's, there's a thing. There's a, hmm? Oh. Probably move it. Cool, 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 cool. You know cool. what they say. Falling off a rock only makes us stronger. No, that's I not... I don't think that's quite how the saying goes. Trying to traverse a gap. There may be a boulder nearby. Cool, cool, cool. Yes. I'm okay. going to jump. Don't fall and crack your skull. All right. What do we got? What do we got? But yeah, I like straightforward maps. What can I say? Hmm. That one looks. That one looks potentially stronger than the usual. It's got a mask for some reason. Bottle. That's good. That's good. I actually want to fight it. I want to see what this thing can do. Oh, wait, let's grab this first. Come on, come on, come on, big fella. Let's go. A foe worth killing. Bat Baron. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's, let's move away and, and recover our souls. Oh, okay, so this is a form of... See, this is just fine. I'm I'm not I'm not gonna face tank. I know I know how to dodge. No, no, stop, 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 please. No, 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 no. What's what is going on? Oh god. So I can't use the hmm. Yes. No, no. I can't die here. What? No. No. Wait, wait. Oh, wait, wait. I need to Hold on. Ah. Mm. How do I You can you can do it. You can do it. Mm. Oh god, is it How do I How do I do that again? How do I How do I switch control? Oh god. Uh, 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 uh. Oh, yeah, life bottle. That's right. Yeah, uh-huh, uh-huh. Wait. I can make him use an item? Wait. Okay. If... I'm making him use... Mm. 
Wait. Okay, hold on. So it didn't seem to let me select her as being the one to use an item. Is that because she... So if I use the life bottle for him, would that he then be using it on me? Like, is that controlling who uses the item or who gets the item? I guess I'll find out. Ah, okay, and then it's who I use it on. All right, gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. No, 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 no. What? No, no. Why? Recover. Okay. All right. You're fine, Rokuro. You are absolutely fine. Wait, how do I how do I use yeah, there's the there's the cooking thing. What do I what do I do 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 the cooking? You told me this earlier. You, ah, there we go. Cooking. Cook and eat. Pickleboar sausage. I'm done. <clears throat> Anything else need chopping? You sure you want me for this? All right. Okay. Cool. All right. So. That's, I guess, a mini boss. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Good to know. Good. You're a fine swordsman. Ooh. Not as far as I'm concerned. I still have a long way to go. Mm. What sort of demon are you? A Yaksha. I'm a war demon. Okay. A war demon. Makes sense. And what about you? You're awfully peculiar, even for a demon. I'm a Therian. Therian? That's a new one for me. What sort of demon is that? A monster that feeds on foes to gain power. I don't know much beyond that. Hmm. Huh. A woman who devours her enemies. I bet your demon. Yeah, she really changed a lot bad. in one gamer. Am I right? What? Whoa. <laughs> You've got the death glares down at least. Ooh. What sword style do you use? Who taught you? I'm self taught. For being self taught, you're really good. Your fundamentals are solid too. But then you suddenly throw out these kicks and all these other moves. It's really unusual. Like I said, it's my own style. What about you, huh? What's with those two swords? You say that big one is your life, yet you never even draw it. Yeah. It's best that I don't. Oh, really? Huh? Is that part of what you learned at House Rangetsu? Yeah, we pay our debts. That's the foundation of everything we do. Okay. I don't get it. Sage, awesome. Love it. All 
All right, so I'm gonna see if we can get to the, I think this might be where the, the dude is. If that's the case, we'll do that, which is probably like a boss battle of some kind. Might take a little while, but then after, we'll call the stream. I think that'd be a pretty good place to end it. Mm, run, 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 run. And then grab these. You know, maybe I actually should fight some of these guys just for the sake of, like, getting XP and stuff. That way I level up and whatnot. You said you can't taste anything. How is your sense of smell? Hmm. Why do you ask? Those two, two are very related, together. yeah. You know, like how if you pinch your nose while you eat, the flavor goes away? If anything, I think my sense of smell has improved. What about you? All my senses are sharper now. Still, being able to smell but not taste. Hmm. You said Eutherians eat demons, right? Not what I'd call a pleasant diet. Look who's talking. What do you eat? I drink, mostly. <laughs> that doesn't sound pleasant either. Nonsense. There's nothing with more depth and variety. Every ingredient, every process alters the whole. The rich, complex flavor dancing across the tongue. The mellow aroma exhilarating the nose. Eh, but what would a child know of such things? Whatever. Oh, I thought she was going to say, how old are you anyways? Stuff goes to my head faster than before, too. Oh. Now that you're a demon, huh? Please tell me we're going to... I mean, don't actually tell me because, you know, spoilers, but I hope at some point we get, like, a drunk hangout skit with the characters. I feel like that would be a ton of fun. That looks like a portal to a boss area or something. Well, no, no, yeah, Velvet's 19, but... But, um, what's his face? Old he is. Because since he's like, oh, psh, you're a child. It's like, okay, first off, warp points. Ooh. That's cool. We got quick travel. This can make for an interesting combat. An exorcist. Area. Did he slip and fall? All right, here's our demon. No, he was thrown in. Oh, diabolical! In all of an enemy's weak points during a combo, will activate a weak point combo, greatly increasing your damage with each consecutive hit. Demon style. D demon dial is weak against demi humans, fire and earth. So velvet's harsh rebuttal. The searing edge to tearing thorn combo will activate a weak point combo. Oh god. I don't know what the abilities are called. So it's battle. Searing edge to tearing thorn followed by harsh rebuttal. Feels like a lot to... We found our murderer. More fools from Helafus came hunting me down, did you? It seems that way. Oh right, I can't do the triple combo with only two souls. Stop. 
He visually seems actually, like, less scary than the other demons that we faced. Now, oh, whoop. Now, granted, I get the feeling that's probably as a way to show that, like, demons are people too, right? Even though they're not treated as such by society. went pretty quickly not until i have my revenge there now we figure out that like oh maybe we don't want to kill him the bastards at the guild who tried to kill me they want me to take the fall oh ah all right i like it are you saying the whole guild was involved damn you think a second rate sailor like me could pull off all that mischief how do we go against the entire guild i mean sure i was in on it Helping them wasn't without its benefits. <laughs> he has a point. It would take more than one person to dig that tunnel into the warehouse. That's a great point. The problem <sighs> is, our extra-legal activities were a little too successful. The Abbey was bound to notice us at some point. Hmm. And dead men tell no tales. So they blame... <laughs> exactly, Abbey G. Yeah. ...to cover it up. Looks like it's not going quite how they planned. How do you mean to get this revenge of yours? The raid on Helebees. I've killed a lot of them. This I swear. That would be suicide. Yeah. Do you have any idea how many exorcists are around? They'll hunt me down no matter what I do. I just want the guild to pay for what they did to me. Okay. That's all I wanted. But I guess... Even that's not going to work out. Oh! Ah, nice. Cut off his tail and then bring that back. We'll take this back to town and tell him you're dead. That cool. should be enough to satisfy the exorcist and get nice. him to off the search. But why? I have my reasons. We need a boat fixed for starters. Plus, if you stir things up after I leave, I imagine it'll slow down anyone who's following me. Ah, nice. Cool, cool, cool. If that's what you want, miss, I won't let you die. So she's still being brutal because he's going to go and die, basically. He could, at this point, just disappear or hope to disappear and survive, but... Yeah, yeah, exactly. Like, yeah, yeah. I don't know if that would necessarily convince people. It's like, he is a lizard, you know... Denor bottle. Curious potion that inside a dungeon instantly sends you to the entrance. As long as you've passed through it before. Cool. Sing left trigger while inside a dungeon. Yep, yep, yep. Get them from shops or treasure chests. Okay. Oh, 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 oh. Lavender. Increased attack by two. Oh, yeah. I like, I like. <laughs> Get all the stuff from in here. By the way, how on earth did you find out where I was hiding? Luck. And a solid hunch. The village I grew up in was the dullest, gloomiest place ever. I hated it so much I became a sailor first chance I could get. But look at me now. If I could do it all again, I wouldn't abandon my home. I see. 
All right. Damn. Self-fulfilling stuff right there. Uh, technically, I was the one who took your tail. Sorry about that. But... Oh, right. And then... Hey! Maybe I should have saved it. Might have been a good idea. Okay. All right. We are going to call it there for tonight. Ugh. Ooh. I feel like that's it. All right. Skits? Are there skits? Huh? Is this really how you want yeah, to play there's... Listen, I'm being hunted too. It's only a matter of time. I can't afford sympathy. Okay. All right. So, so far, I like it. I like it a lot. The characters are wonderful. The start to the story was really good, even though it was like predictable as hell. Like, well, not, not, well, actually, no, 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 no. Hold on. No, it wasn't entirely. The whole thing of something bad would happen, that was predictable. But how, what the bad thing would be, I actually did not expect. I, I did not see it coming that it would be Arthur. Um, I thought Arthur was just going to be the thing of, oh, he's absent when the bad thing happens. And then it's like, oh, no, you know, um, I did not expect him to be the baddie, though. That was uh, that was interesting. Um, and the fact that, yeah, I mean, yeah, of course the brother was going to die. It's like, oh, no, I need to go make sure my brother's OK. But, yeah, um, I like that we're getting introduced to the party fairly quickly. Um, the fact that Mogilu was one of the first is always just, you know, like, mm, yeah, uh, I, will, I will appreciate that, of course. Because um, I, I, was, I was aware that there, you wouldn't necessarily meet all of the party right away, like Caleb told me that. And it's like, well, yeah, that's you know, pretty standard for JRPG, right? You want to get them one at a time. That way you can get to know them. But the fact that she was one of the first is like, cool. The style of the game is great. I love how they're sort of setting up all, all the injustices in the world and everything so that then the eventual fighting of God or Arthur when he ascends or something like that um, makes a lot of sense. Uh, the way they're handling the inner demon thing I think is really fun um, with it not necessarily being like a separate entity with ego and, and intelligence and all that, but it's just that, oh, you're losing aspects of yourself, right? And that's part of how the characters get quirky and whatnot, you know? Um, uh, but yeah, I really like it. If anything, there's some aspects to the mechanics that feel a little bit, like, bogged down-y. Like, it, it's weird. Because, because my main other JRPG to compare it against, as far as, like, gameplay and everything, really is Persona 4, right? Because you could say Nier Automata, but, but it's really more set up as an action game. It's like Nier Automata, I feel like, is set up more akin to like Yakuza 0 than, than Persona 4 or, or Tales of Berseria. And some things, like, there's a lot of it that I'm just still getting used to. So things like the cooking and all of that stuff and the different combos and setting up the different combos for the buttons and things like that. So it's, it's a lot, you know? Um, but I'll probably just get used to it eventually and it'll be just fine. Um, uh, but yeah. Yeah. Uh, let's see. What else? What else? Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm having fun with it, you know? I might take this one a little bit slower. You know, if you notice, I stopped talking to, like, the random NPCs and stuff eventually, because it's just like, okay, there's so many of them, that would, that would really slow down gameplay. Um, but yeah, I feel like this, this game does a lot of things with the characters that are subversions of what you would expect right the party is a bunch of people that don't care if they kill people right you know that kind of thing more anti-heroes and yet it's also setting it up for the sort of the tropes that we know and love about jrpgs to really hit hard right found family why is found family important right like like using not not that i want to compare this game to persona and persona 4 and things like that like because they're very different games but in Persona, as as contrast, found family was a thing where it's like, okay, you get it, it's awesome, right? And it's and it's a and it's a super positive, sweet thing and whatnot. Yeah, you, you know, you come to understand, you, you know, yourself and all that stuff. But 
main character is very much like, ah, kind of blank slate main character, right? Whereas in, in Velvet's case, it's something where it's the, okay, very specific personality, right? Um, and we're going to set up exactly why the found family trope will be needed, why it will be such a bomb, right? And that is something that I really appreciate because then you've got the high highs and the low lows, right? You know, you, you have the happiness and everything at the beginning, it gets brought down, it's predictable, but they understand why they're doing the tragic backstory, right? A lot of the times I feel like in stories less recently because the you know the farm that gets burned is is not done as much anymore but if you're gonna do that then sell us on the farm right i was legit upset that some of those characters died not just the brother but but freaking nico like like she was fun i wanted her to be like an ongoing like member of the cast maybe right but nope they're all dead and and while that was like i was i was surprised at how how long it was taking to actually actually get to the point where everybody died right because when like when we had to go out and and find i got it how am i how am i forgetting his name she keeps saying his name but the brother i thought that that was going to be when everything bad happened right forgot about the fact that it's daytime at that point and it was supposed to be at night um yeah laffy taffy yeah exactly La laffy set thank you for reminding me but um but no the game took its time with it and and that's something where where like i i want to commend the game for doing that because oftentimes like i'll i'll take stories that are like games or shows or movies or whatever and i'll try and compare them to like how things would go in a book right and there are certain things that you can do in a game that you really can't do in a book one of the things is having optional content right and Things like the the people that you can talk to, you know, around the city, or the skits with the characters, those are great examples because if someone doesn't want to deal with those, they don't have to. Now, they're, the skits in particular are fantastic, you would hope they would, but if you were to have all the skits that are probably in this game, right, like the, the main story for this game could probably be shortened down to something pretty manageable, right? Like, as far as, like, book, book length. But if you had the skits in there, then it gets ridiculously big right if you have all the flavor stuff of interacting with the town before everybody dies that could be a solid you know chapter or two right before everything goes to shit and that's kind of where the story starts so that's something that's uh, it's a lot more expensive of a cost basically so the fact that they did that in this game and i'm not sure if this is like a part of it is because the tales games have this reputation so they basically have that like audience interest where they can be like no no no, we're gonna spend a little bit of time in this town don't worry don't go anywhere you know that this game's gonna be good and then you can get suckered into the thing that you know is going to go badly right you know a lot of these characters are gonna die and yet you're drawn into caring about them in spite of that because it can be really easy when when a character's demise is predictable to just be like, oh, well, you know, then you sort of distance yourself because you're like, I know what they're trying to do. I'm not going to let myself be emotionally manipulated. And and that's why so much of the early stages of this game, I was like, no, no, like, come on, oh, game, I know what you're doing. Because there was that resistance within me to be like, nope, I'm not going to care about these characters. That's, mm, mm, mm. It's, you're, 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 you're too direct, right? This isn't going to work. Right? Even though I, I love that feeling of getting eviscerated by stuff. And and yet, in spite of all of that, things like the comb. Things like, you know, Nico, you know, being like, all right, let's talk about boys and stuff, right? It all added to the effect. And, and yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm having a lot of fun with it. But. <sighs> we are talking nine and a half hours without optional skits, as in just cutscene runtime. Yeah, and and on the one hand, it's like, whoa, that's a lot, nine and a half hours. And yet, at the same time, that's actually, in a lot of ways, it doesn't feel like a whole lot, you know? Like, if you were to think of that as, like, a TV show, you know? It's like, okay, yeah, that's, that's a TV show. You know, that's, that's, that's a little bit longer than, like, a, a regular anime. But then, of course, there's the skits on top of that, so... Yeah. Yeah. But, anyways... Thank you all for hanging out. This was a ton of fun. Um, 
But uh, yeah, yeah, I was talking to Core Anime Gooey. Um, but yeah, we do streams throughout the week, all at 3 p.m. Pacific time, um, uh, Monday through Friday. Mondays we do podcasts, we talk about storytelling, anime, and all that stuff. Sometimes we, you know, chill and do like a game or something like that. But uh, and then Tuesdays we do manga readings. Right now we're doing Grand Blue Dreaming. It is wonderful. It is fantastic. There is much water and oolong tea consumed. I highly recommend you check those out. It's it's a hilarious, amazing, wonderful manga. And then Wednesdays and Fridays, Caleb's doing gaming. He's doing Dark Souls 2 right now. Um, and is he on to the DLC? Okay, cool. And then, of course, Thursdays, gaming with me right now. Tales of Berseria. But yeah, um, I will see y'all later. But until then, I have been Jacob of Semblance of Sanity. I love you very much. Take care, everyone, and good night. Oh, all right. Well. Okay, new game, new game. I gotta say, the uh, outfit for the main character, I am very much a fan of. It is totally extra and edgy, but I feel like it also works. Like, as far as making me care about a tragic backstory for a character early on, did it very nicely. And seeing how she's a completely different person now, you know, the going from the protective, doting big sis to, oh yeah, no, let's let's just kill people and stuff, you know. Oh, no, I don't cook. That was great. The bit with the apple. That was a nice, nice touch. Oh, yeah. Yeah, Berseria. Oh, Berseria. That sounds kind of like Berserk. And oh, no, there's an eclipse. Hmm. No, probably not a thing. I don't know. Maybe. See you all next week. Bye.